Eh. I'm, uh... Well, I mean, welcome back to Sweet and D. How, how you guys doing? It's, um... It's a nice Friday night. Day. Whatever you want. Or wherever, whenever you're watching this on YouTube or something. It's a... It's a, it's a good time. And we're, we're back with Sweet and D. Um... I'm glad you all could make it. It's, uh... It's gonna be a good time. I can't keep that up. Uh, I knew it. <laughs> I, just, I wanted to see how far you were going to take that bit. Yeah. <laughs> Welcome back, everybody! everybody. <laughs> we just fucking smothered all of your energy with silence. Yeah. <laughs> oh, yeah! <laughs> Uh, <laughs> welcome back, oh, everybody. Um, we're we gonna play some uh, heckin' D and D by by dudes. Uh, hooray! But before we get into it, we're gonna heckin' go over our inspiration rules for anybody who's new or something. Uh, so if you feel like uh, you know, saving your favorite characters from dying or maybe dooming them. Um, you, you can help do so. Uh, you can donate five dollars, uh, Canadian per point of inspiration for the players, one dollar per point of inspiration for the DM. The players can spend one point to give themselves advantage on an ability check or attack roll, or spend ten points to automatically succeed on an ability check or attack roll. This has to be something they would normally be able to succeed at, so no finding out the tr uh, true names of devils or anything of the like. And, <clears throat> With that said, let's go ahead and play some D&D. &D. Woo! Woo! Ah! Ah! Goodbye, YouTube. Ah! Or goodbye, chat. I miss you. Great. Like, how dare you? <laughs> goodbye, goodbye Johnny. Love you so much. Me. All right. I'm going to heckin' roll this fancy die here, and we're going to see better. who's it going to be. No! <laughs> Fucking damn it! Who was it? <laughs> Who oh my it? God, no, Carrie! It? Yes, it's you. No. I rolled. I rolled no, three I did it fours. Last time. I, I did it rolled, last time. I rolled three fours. It's no. your time. No, <laughs> keep going. Nope, you're doing it. The dice. No, I'm decided. not. Yes, you are. Mansion game did it. <laughs> <laughs> Carrie, I First actually. Try. I was. At, I talked to Spencer about this last night because I was just like. The few times I've done it weren't like especially good, and it's been a fucking minute since I did it. And it's like, like I'd like to do it. <laughs> like, <laughs> well, no, no, I was just. It wasn't even. It wasn't even that I wanted to. I was just like, have the dice rolls really been like that against Izzy and I? Because it's been like <laughs> you and Jace like for mm -hmm. a good chunk of time. We're cursed. Mm -hmm. The dice can sense that we don't want to do it. We're not prepared, <laughs> and the <laughs> dice <laughs> know. Uh, but like, I also multiple. don't want to do it. Why aren't I cursed? <laughs> <laughs> no, no. Here's the thing. I think it's because of the two extremes. Uh, carries are the most panicked. Chases mm. are the funniest. It's true. Mm -hmm. I think true. it's for the entertainment value. The gods seek their entertainment. Mm -hmm. But yeah, no. I specifically talked to Spencer about this. And he's like, yeah, no, that is weird. I'm, I'm going to put in extra dice rolls. So the fact... That it was no, no, fuck you. <laughs> Carrie's doing it. <laughs> so go ahead, I think Carrie. That you give should the be nice to Mac and let him do it, Spence. I'll roll the dice one more should time. Let Mac do it. Okay, Fucking... Izzy, go ahead. <laughs> oh, hey. Thank God. <laughs> okay, let's see. So we're on a boat. I believe there there's some arm wrestling. Mm -hmm. Um. I think Lance won that whole deal, if I'm remembering correctly. That sounds yep. right. Yeah. Yeah. Everybody, yeah. Uh, we scavenged some booze from, like, a wreck in the ocean that we thought... Like, we were pretty convinced for a hot second that, you know, something was going to happen, but it, it was just booze. Mm -hmm. And then, uh, let's see here. What else happened? Uh, oh, yeah, uh... Val and Drake were just kind of going at each other, trying to get information. That was a pretty good time. Going I ship it. at each other. Going at each other. <laughs> mm, trying to wheedle out the deepest, darkest secrets. Whoa. Deepest. Yeah, and then there's there's a bit of a ruckus. I, I think. Yeah, Val got tired of Kasim's fucking 
shenanigans and tried to tie him up and throw him overboard. You put him to sleep. Captain made him wake him back up, and then they had to clean the sails. One of these times, that's not going to work. <laughs> <laughs> we'll see about that. Yeah, I think you're skipping over the context over why Val wanted to beat up Kasim. That's mm. fine. Probably pretty unreasonable. <laughs> <laughs> he was just trying to help his brother out. <laughs> um, let's see. There was that guy, Quara. He was trying to recruit some people, it seemed, for some some wet work. Mm -hmm. and, uh, there was there was a big ship approaching, and we were also thinking like, okay, this is gonna be it. This they're gonna be evil. They're gonna be pirates. But no, they were like, hey, you want some food? Yeah, fine. <laughs> and uh, that's pretty much all I can remember. Hey, the only, only thing I'd throw in is the mandolin player. We finally learned his name. Yep. Mm, yeah, we did. Oh yeah, did we not know his name before? Cross. Not really. You guys didn't really interact with him. The At main all. person who interacted with him was uh, Drake. Yeah. Huh. So, there you go. <clears throat> I'm gonna get it. <laughs> you, did, you did make a. You did make an arrangement with him. So, mm -hmm. once, you, once you get to the. I was promised you, things. <laughs> Meanwhile, Oromax already got it. Yep. <laughs> I know, right? He's prepared. All right. I mean, you paid for it. Like, I'm earning it. I'm kidding. <laughs> <laughs> you right. think you're that cheap a date, huh? <laughs> yes. No. <laughs> All right. So, uh... I think we left off where you, with you guys. Where did we leave off at the very end of last session? Um, Val told Kasim the stuff that he said to Hecate and Cora. I was about it. Right, and you guys ended the day there. Well, yeah, and then okay. went to bed. Mm. It was it was a very very weird cliffhanger. <laughs> mm -hmm. I guess we'll all just. Go peacefully to sleep, I guess. Mm -hmm. <laughs> oh, okay. no. So, it is now Sunday, uh, the 1st of November. Uh, you guys still have... Uh, two, three, four, five... Eh, eh, eh. Uh, you guys got five days left until you're expected... Uh... Damn! Huh. Yeah. We're gonna uh, die we can on... make that last two more sessions. Yeah, we can. Well, it's a uh, four, four days. Sorry. <coughs> One and a half more sessions. Yeah, you're about Are halfway you? to to Gundarlin. <laughs> so, um, uh, you guys, uh, <laughs> what would you guys like to do, if anything in particular? Uh, it's so it's a new day. It is a new day. Uh, <laughs> go ahead and roll your roll your things. <clears throat> I'm also gonna roll. Oh shit! <laughs> yes. yes. Oh, that's good. Oh, Someone's that's good. Have a bad time today. Someone's gonna eat shit today. God damn. God damn. <laughs> yeah, apparently. Uh. What okay. do those rolls represent? <laughs> uh, Izzy can give those d20 rolls to people. Mm -hmm. Uh, at like once per day, basically. Oh no. <laughs> so he could, yeah. you know, make an enemy nat one when they attack one of us or something yeah. like that. God damn. Spanker, I still have my temporary hit points for my last weakness trigger. Do I need to do it again or just leave it as is? If you're spending enough, gonna roll until you can do those anyway. for free. Like, just keep it. Like, yeah. You can just keep doing that, it yeah. until you cool. get the max, so it doesn't really matter. Yep. And I hadn't used them yet, so they're still I still there. feel like Hooray, the only way cool. it's relevant if you're going to try to re-roll for them is if you physically or audibly do something when you do it. Like, if you have to go, like, Yeah! <laughs> 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 How could I do that every morning? <laughs> <laughs> Just like, wake up in my hand, like, <laughs> <laughs> like Yeah, yeah, yeah. Are you doing crunches over I'm there? I'm good. You gotta, yeah, right. you gotta do it like fucking 40 times. It just doesn't work for you. And you're like, God damn it. 
Um, do it like one day, I do it 40 times, and then the next day I do it like twice, and you're like, I don't know what the fuck she's doing every morning. <laughs> There's Max. no consistency to what she's doing. Max. Yes. Highs or lows? Um. Uh, highs. Okay. Max? Yeah, I can't I hear him. Oh, there he is. I can't hear him. You could. Yeah, oh, it was just oh there delayed. he is. Weird. Sorry. Uh, okay. <clears throat> That's a, that's a good thing. Um, so oh. that's a good thing. You're all attacked. Uh, so uh, <laughs> today the the weather is normal for this time of year. Um, there is no wind, however. Uh oh. Um, so a lot of the sailors are uh, having to like take out ro- uh, like oars and row the boat themselves. Oh. That's that's what's happening with the crew members and whatnot. I'm all right. I'm proud of the. I feel bad that I know we can say I feel bad. I'm not strong for helping. <laughs> I'm so not strong. You don't have to be strong mm-hmm. to help. <laughs> okay, I, I'll I'll go help with that then. Thank you. Right. Sure. <clears throat> you are free to do so. Doing it. Cool. Who el- who else is helping? Who's around me? It's, uh. uh... I'll 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 be working in there, but I'll definitely like <clears throat> be sitting more on like the edge of the sheet of uh, the seat, so I can like piece out to go back to the kitchen mm-hmm. when uh, when it's sort of time mm-hmm. to make something for the crew. Gotcha. But you know, strong boy. Strong boy. Yeah. Cool. Strong boy. Very <clears throat> strong. Like the rest of the oars have like three people to him, or he's just got one to himself. <laughs> yeah. Like, fucking. <laughs> like shit. Oh dear. Uh, tr- 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 <laughs> <laughs> okay. Yeah, who else is second Rowan? Store Rowan? The captain Store is rowing. Out, watching us all row. Hmm. Uh, Store is rowing. Um, let's see. It's pretty much out of all like the uh, note like NPCs with names. Uh, Store is pretty much the only one helping. Okay. Chandri is, you know. That makes sense. <laughs> yeah. And Quora isn't interested. Uh, <laughs> Damn, <that's laughs> cool. So, yeah. That's. Uh, What's the captain doing? Uh, she's captaining. Okay. Yep. She's like observing she's like fucking us. She's asleep or... in her cabin. <laughs> that's what I'm wondering. Like, is she she's around? She's steering the ship. Or... Benefits cool. of captain. Mm hmm. Hell yeah. She is okay. telling everybody what to do. She is leading. <laughs> Hell yeah. Cool. Okay. All right. <clears throat> so. Uh, Can it roll a strength check to see how poorly I row? <laughs> sure. <laughs> Sweet. <laughs> do it. Nat 20. <laughs> yeah, that was, that <laughs> yeah. <laughs> uh, <clears throat> I'm sort of helping. Sorta. You sure are sort of helping. Mm-hmm. Yep, Drake is. Uh, luckily, you've got a lot of people there with you. Um, Hell yeah. Store offers uh, you some help in rowing if you need it. Aww. Gladly accept that. Mm-hmm. It is like the like mm-hmm. the the whole fucking romantic comedy movie or romantic movie just gets behind oh, you, and shows <gasps> you how to do it. <laughs> oh. oh, thank you. <laughs> <laughs> That's so good. <laughs> I'm very happy. Theme also, from- damn Ori, <laughs> shit. Music from Ghost starts playing. <laughs> <laughs> I was thinking it yet. <laughs> All right. Well, Captain's like the fuck. Glory <laughs> representing almost two Drakes or uh, almost three Drakes worth of rowing. Yeah, <laughs> yeah pretty much. Damn. A Drake is a unit of measurement. Mm-hmm. <laughs> Hell yeah. Yikes. It's oh, a good time. Okay. God damn. Cool. That's what I'm oh, doing. What are y'all doing? <laughs> Oh, there is also a light rain. Uh, oh, geez. I'm gonna be inside. <laughs> Coward. Yes. 
<laughs> You're right. <laughs> you There's really no light just here. Sit there and say correct things at me like that. Mm -hmm. <laughs> okay. Yeah, Val's probably just chilling. Okay. Uh, just hanging out. Kasim, what are you doing? With Kasim? Like with Kasim or like probably on deck? with Kasim. Yeah, sounds about right. What are you doing, Kasim? Just chilling with Val. Okay. All right. Okay. <laughs> can I uh, can I see if like I can store will tell me more information about store? Like just mm -hmm. kind of have a casual conversation with him while we're rowing. Sure. While he's wrapped cool. around. He you. is damn right. <laughs> store is very. He's a very open uh, dude. He's mm -hmm. he he's a very open book, so to say. Mm -hmm. Um. Oh uh, yeah, he uh, he tells you that he was he is um, let's see, he's a, he was a messenger from Gundarlin. He came to Neverwinter on behalf of King <laughs> Oldgrave Red Axe to bring news of the <laughs> of the crash to Nor Lord Neverwinter. What what is his like job? Because I know that like the king sent him. So like, what's his like occupation? That's what I'm trying to. <laughs> messenger, okay, cool. who he sent the messing? Also, I'm just fucking asking you shit, and I'm not like role playing at all. I'm so sorry. <laughs> That's fine. <laughs> Dude, it's cool. It's fine. It's only a tabletop. We've got four, four games. games to kill. I don't care. <laughs> uh, where's the first main? All this is he. Yes, is he I'm helping? Oh my God. I, like, I like the idea that he'd be with Oramax, so it's just like Oramax rowing and kind of like picking him up off the seat by like, oh, I was like, he'd do it. like, like he's <laughs> he's not even really rowing; he's just holding onto the oar and just being lifted. Like, yeah, I'm pretty helping. much. Yeah. <laughs> uh, he he divides his time between that and hanging out with Quora. <laughs> oh no! <laughs> Well, I need to put a stop to Mr. It. <laughs> Alexander. <laughs> mostly <Says> in like, <laughs> mostly like, uh, just playing, you know, card games with him and whatnot. Just sort of following him around. No. <laughs> um, but uh, probably no danger there. Uh, Store was a. Uh, he was also a member of the the King's fleet. Um, mm -hmm. yeah, uh, he, he tells you, a, depending on how much you, you want to learn about it, I guess. Um, oh, everything. Gib. Okay. Uh, <laughs> he tells you that the soldiers of Gundarlin are all manning the king's fleet, a group of nearly 200 longships mm. trying to protect the island and surrounding, uh, ocean from pirates and, uh, Sahuagin raiders. Okay, you're gonna need to spell some shit for me, man. <laughs> okay, like what? What kind of raiders? Sahuagin. <laughs> Roll me a nature check. Oh. Never had to do one of these before. Am I good at them? Oh, that's what I thought. Not so. <laughs> okay. Okay. Number. Not bad. Not bad. Yeah. You know them by a different name. Uh, they they go by like oh. a lot of people call them uh, sea devils. Uh, they're sort of oh. humanoid shark people who uh, who huh. live in, who live in ocean. They're aquatic people. They're an aquatic people who are very dangerous. Uh, a lot of people have been killed by them. So a lot of sailors mm. and uh, ships have been just taken down. But um, uh, Sahuagin is mm. spelled S-A-H-U-A-G-I-N. There you go. And then... <clears throat> he tells you as well that rumor has it the... <coughs> the cough. Um... Rumor. rumor has it that the vessel um, the cr in the crash 
Uh, rumor has it that the vessel fell from the sky in the territory of Jarl Frostgale uh, on the west coast oh of God. Gundarlin. Uh, some strange creatures managed to escape the vessel and killed a few farmers. What was the area in Gundarlin again? Sorry. So from the uh, sky in... Uh, in the territory of Jarl Frostgale. Spell that, please. <laughs> Jarl, like J-A-R-L. Frostgale, how you think you spell it. All okay, word. cool. Uh, is on the west coast of Gundarlin. Um, let's see. Uh, he tells you then that only two people witnessed the crash and survived, but the remains are there for all to see. Oh. And most folk think the crash is just a strange wrecked pirate ship and the deaths were caused by the crew. All this uh, hearsay about fa uh, falling from the sky and monsters inside the wreck, uh, he thinks, are just foolish superstition. Oh. Yeah. yeah. Mm -hmm. He also tells you that uh, <clears throat> uh, he's very eager to get back to get back to Gundarlin. Do you have like special things waiting for you there? Uh uh, not, not really. Um, I'm just eager to get back to the the king's fleet, uh, serving by my comrades. I'm, uh, mm. yeah, miss them a bit. <laughs> Aww. It's a shame you couldn't bring like more of your comrades with you on this mission. Well, they're very that. busy. There's been an influx of pirate attacks and and the the raiders. The sea devils. So, the, every man on deck, very busy. I was chosen by my king to uh, uh, to deliver this message. It's very important. Okay, just because I'm, I'm a dumb. Um, the, like, 200 ships. Are they at, like, the king's disposal? The shark humanoid ships? Are they the uh, king's the or no? They the they're being attacked by like... those shark humanoid people. Yeah. Okay. Double checking. The oh, long ships shit. are part That's of fair. the king's yeah. fleet. Yes. Uh, they are Kay. there. They're basically being they're surrounding like the island to protect uh, the island from pirates and sea devils. Okay. <clears throat> so, yeah. There you go. Okay. Thank you. You're very oh, welcome. Yeah. We're halfway done with the journey, so we can stick it out a little bit longer. Hmm. It'll be okay. Yeah. I'll, uh, <laughs> they eager to get back. <laughs> hmm. But not too eager, as I get to lay eyes on a very pretty girl. <gasps> Where? Hmm. Funny. <laughs> mm hmm. Any, uh,. Rowan. Continue. Continue rowing. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> and. Hell yeah. A good, good boy. Yeah. That's pretty much what y'all are doing. I uh, think. Uh, hmm. Unless other stuff's going on, uh, Val would probably want to go maybe play some cards with Quora. Cool. Oh, shit! Cool. I would like to ask. Kasim, where he is. Um, before or after he goes to play cards? Uh, before and after. Uh, before, he wants you, boy. Before, he was probably just hanging out with Val. Um, uh, I think he he's probably like hanging around watching the card game, but uh, I don't I don't think he's playing just yet. Gotcha. Cool. Um. All right, then. Cards, so, the you guys cards. go... Uh, what? The cards, the cards. <laughs> the cards will tell. The cards will tell. Present and the future as well. <laughs> Correct. Wrong cards will tell if I win the pot. Shut the fuck up. <laughs> <laughs> uh, okay. All right. 
So you want to go play cards with the uh, Hanged with Man High? <laughs> yeah. God. Oh, all right. We'll go over to Quora. Hmm. Well, hi there. You seem otherwise occupied. Oh. Not fit to begin rowing, are we? <laughs> uh, physical labor's not really my strong suit. I'm here to entertain. <laughs> so, well, perhaps hmm. we can find some other form of entertainment then, and I'll put my deck of playing cards onto our makeshift table situation. Interested in a route of cards, are you? I suppose. Sounds um, fun. Though I'm sure I won't be as much competition as uh, your companion. I'll gesture over to the first mate. <laughs> oh, he's great company. I'm sure there. he is. Mm -hmm. Quick what learner. What do the two of you get up to? Uh, we we just been playing cards. He's been teaching me how to play a bunch of games. How to, you know, win. Mm hmm. Uh huh. <laughs> <laughs> and have you been there. doing very much? Really? I know I'm not here. It's upsetting me. Uh, Drake's parents are going to be so proud of both of them. Mm hmm. <laughs> <laughs> you better believe it. Uh, she sorry, lies to them, and it's like, Drake also taught me how to cheat. <laughs> 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 And have you been doing much winning, first mate? Oh, oh yeah, definitely. I've I've won like almost every game. You you see like a slight shake from uh, from Cora. <laughs> <laughs> I and bet you have. I'm Lance sure you're Lance looks very at Cora. He turns turns into a nod, like. Mm, mm -hmm. <laughs> <laughs> I'm sure you're quite the shrewd card player. <laughs> you better believe it. Well, you want to go around? Hmm? Sure. Yeah. All right. That sounds like fun. All right. Cool. <laughs> Let's play. He gets a very intense look on his face. <laughs> <laughs> I'm down. Cool. Let's go. I all get right. the feeling yeah. he's going to have the worst poker face. <laughs> uh, oh, all boy. right. So, um, there's no real, like, you know, game here it's just mm -hmm. we're gonna do some some dice rolls okay uh, yeah so we are gonna do some uh intelligence uh checks mm -hmm. so sounds good yeah contested uh yeah contested intelligence checks intelligence, intelligence. I'll, uh, as as Get cards are going out Mm. I'll uh, I'll say. So then, what are we betting? What are we wagering, boys? Uh, could bet a bit of gold if you're interested. Oh, I'm I'm down. What about you, first mate? I. Uh, he leans over to La to Quora. Can you spot me? <laughs> <laughs> wow. Oh, it's no problem if you don't have any money. We can bet other things. Like. Well, information, no. rumors, favors, no. things in our possession that we might have. Interesting. What about, uh, <laughs> what say you first, mate? Interested? Oh, yeah, I've got a lot of dirty secrets. Oh, my God. <laughs> ah! <laughs> Yes. With all the noises Carrie's making, I'm just picturing Drake <laughs> just suddenly getting like blushy and like awkward and and like, mm, it's just like everyone's looking at her like what the fuck? She's like I don't know, I don't know. I sense something <laughs> wrong. <laughs> yeah, she's just rowing and then it all of a sudden fucking sits up straight like something's wrong. <laughs> like fucking. There's a disturbance oh. in the force. <laughs> yeah. Oh. Yeah. Uh, I'll. Go on, I'll try to be quiet. I'm so sorry. <laughs> I'll, uh, I'll pull out uh, from my from my bag one of my one of my daggers and put it on the table. Be like, I could start with this if you're interested in that. You pull out a dagger? Yeah, like a dagger. It's like one of my two daggers I got. You want to? Bet I know Quora's got daggers. <laughs> you want to bet weapons? Oh, it's just something I have on my person. 
We can bet anything, if you'd prefer information, or if you have anything you're willing to part with. <laughs> uh, do, I fear our first mate doesn't really own any uh, possessions, so I think information would be very interesting. Sure, that works for me, then. Wonderful. I want to see, what, what was Lance's expression when I put up the knife how interested in that was he what's your passive insight uh pretty high uh mm. 16 I think? 16 it's nice. 10 plus your whatever yes uh, modifiers yeah okay oh cool yeah yeah you'd be easily be able to tell like he's he saw the knife he's like oh <laughs> oh i want it <laughs> <laughs> I want a dagger. I guess. That's what I figured. Mm -hmm. uh, but okay. All right. Information it is then. <laughs> All right. Now, let's uh, let's deal. All okay. right. All right. Uh, since it's your deck of cards, are you dealing then, or? Uh, sure. Okay. All right. Cool. Uh. All right, the game shall commence. I need, I need you to roll me an intelligence check, please, while I roll intelligence checks for Quara and Lance. Does Lance oh boy, have a sheet? Lance. Have you been forced to make a sheet for Lance? He's just a commoner. <laughs> That's it. <laughs> With a How very dare you? fancy he costume. The first mate. He's the He's first a... maid. <laughs> Show proper respect. Yeah, man. <laughs> I, the only stat that I changed from a commoner is his strength, which is a negative. <laughs> <laughs> yeah! Uh, okay. Here's my intelligence. It's a nine. Ooh. <laughs> okay. Uh. Wow. Okay. Bad rolls from everybody. <laughs> cool. Excellent. <laughs> Lance uh, rolls a 20. Lance rolls a seven. Oh, yeah! <laughs> hey... And... Look at you go, Lance. I'm so proud. Uh, yeah, this is a very uh, slow round of cards. Um, sort of. Uh, uh, you don't you don't have a very good hand, but apparently neither does everybody else. You win this round of cards. Uh, Seem to have beat me. So, what do you want to know? You want him, uh, him or I to go first? Well... Let's see. Who, does anyone know anything about our fellow passengers? I know about one. Oh, and which one is that? My is sister. That... Oh, I thought it would have been Store over there. Uh, no, I don't know. Why would you think that? I don't know anything about him. Well, it's just he was the one who commissioned this ship to go on the, on the journey, and I had figured as the first mate you must have... Had some inf it's it's fine. I I must have just assumed. Hmm. But that's your sister, you say? Yeah, Drake. Oh, all right. What information do you have about her? What do you want to know? <laughs> mm. <laughs> well, well, first mate, I trust your decision-making skills. What do you think is one very interesting thing about her? One interesting thing. Uh, well, uh, we've got, let's see, she has two dads. Ooh. Mm-hmm. She has two dads. Two dads. <laughs> I'm writing down Well, my... adoptive dads. <laughs> mm-hmm. Oh. Adoptive dads, you say? Mm-hmm. That's interesting. And are they your biological parents? Uh, no. Oh, I see. And, uh, do you have any other brothers or sisters? Uh, that's, yeah, you got your one. All right. Good boy! <laughs> I knew you were a shrewd card player. Mm-hmm. I was I'm totally waiting for him to just go off for like an hour and not realize yeah. he was giving it all <laughs> in the first round. Yeah. I also, like, 
gave like a really easy way for him to just fucking annihilate me where he's like we got two dads mm -hmm. adoptive dads and i'm like are they your biological parents he's like yeah yeah the two dads are my biological parents yeah. one gave <laughs> Yo, birth yeah, to he me could have fucked you up. <laughs> i don't know why i just expected him to fucking <laughs> annihilate me uh, <laughs> uh, okay all right uh this in the background <laughs> <laughs> And you, Quora, do you happen to have any information about anyone on this ship? Oh, I've got information on plenty of people on this ship. It's mine. It's my business to know things. And I'm, I'm sure business must be very good. <laughs> very good. So, who do you want to know about? Well, we're on the subject. Do you happen to know anything about this little man's sister? The first mate? The first mate's sister. I got a bit of information about her. She... Let's see. She's an orphan. Um, That's what I... Uh, yeah, I found out that she was an orphan. She was ado adopted by a... Uh, uh, you know, a couple. Um, Let's see... Who, yeah, that couple owns a brothel. <laughs> I see. Mm. Well, all right then. I appreciate it, lads. Thank you for the round. And would you like another? Be more than happy to play again. Yeah, 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 yeah. I'm, I'm, a, I'm a win this time. <laughs> I'm sure you will. <laughs> He probably will. I'm gonna fucking roll like a one. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> Fuck. All right. I need you to roll me another intelligence check, sir. Oh boy. Do it, bro. Ten. Hmm. All right, Lance. I'm gonna you have roll a twenty. Him roll. Oh my god, he rolled a twenty. <laughs> I was trying to use. I was trying to use poor Ted, but you talked over me. Uh, <laughs> oh no! Ah, uh, you Is cheated. I was- I said it first, and you talked over me! Izzy did start talking before you rolled. Uh, uh, Alright, who did you want to give it to? Right. I was giving Lance a five. Alright, he gets a five. Oh. <laughs> wow. Can't wait for us to be fucking murdered, and this uh, is what you used it on. I saved the one! Lance is, <laughs> okay, I'm just imagining portent happening at that exact speed of Lance being like, ha, four aces, and then it's like, aces are low. <laughs> what? Oh! <laughs> Pushed us onto a better that's, timeline. Here you that's go. not what you <laughs> that, me. <laughs> that, that or he puts down like the the four cards, and it's like, what? Uh, that that appears to be uh, the Joker. What? <laughs> what? I thought we took that out of the deck. <laughs> Just uh, one of the, the card instructions card. <laughs> <laughs> that is the, uh, that is the death card from Kasim's tarot deck. <laughs> <laughs> what? How did that get in? That's crazy. That's crazy. Just take that back. <laughs> Pay it no mind. Uh, anyway, um. Uh, Quara rolled a 16. So he did. Mm -hmm. Oh, shit. So uh, he, he lays out his cards. He is the clear winner here. Mm -hmm, mm -hmm. So what do I want to ask you? Mm. Let's see. Let's see. Um. <laughs> what do you look like without that mask on? Yes, Quora. I'm sure it's nothing particularly impressive, but I suppose I wouldn't mind showing you. Hmm. And I'll just be like, unfortunately, you did win the round, though, so only you're going to get the information. That's true. Uh, hmm. First mate, would you be so kind as to turn a little bit? Uh, I guess. I was so... I was so... Fine. <laughs> <laughs> he turns away. Okay. Is anybody else looking at us? Besides Kasim? Um, yeah, besides Kasim. 
Nah. Cause she knows what I look like under the mask. Oh fuck! Oh, oh shit! shit. <laughs> Can oh, I took shit. her for so long. <laughs> All right. Uh, yep. That's uh, yeah. You do so. Um, okay. Yep. Or no one is around, so you can at least. Okay. Then yeah, I'll, I will do so. Okay. Huh. Uh, not what I pictured. I'll be honest. All right. Put it back on. <laughs> Did you picture nope. something different? Like what? I don't know. Just something. Mm. You've got He's like, like shockingly the... handsome, isn't he? Right. Yeah. I mean, he's just as handsome as I expected, but I don't know. A bit grim. Val's like just staring at Kasim with the mask back on. Like, <laughs> what? Aww. You should have more confidence in yourself. You're a beautiful man. Mm-hmm. <laughs> oh. That's not why I wear the mask, Kasim. <laughs> So you say, little bro. So you say. Uh, Are uh, you perhaps interested in playing cards today, Kasim? <laughs> oh, yes, we love Shit. the company. I'd love to learn more about you. Uh... <laughs> do, it, do, it, do it, do it, do it, you coward, do it. Yeah, sure. <laughs> Got nothing, uh, don't have a lot else to do on the ship right now, why not? I... Yay. <laughs> I I feel like this is a really bad play on Val's part, because don't he and Kasim basically share the secret, so like that just gives Quora and Lance a better chance of learning their shit. Don't worry about it. Do it. <laughs> uh <laughs> all right. So uh deal another hand. Yep. And No no, he still has to That's learn true. from Lance. What was his question to Lance? Oh um, yeah. <laughs> what secrets will Lance tell us? So, Lance, what do I want to ask of you? How'd you get on the ship? Mm. Uh, I was invited on. So mm. how'd you get on the ship? <laughs> <laughs> I swam. You swam? Yeah, it was It was in the dark, and I, I, I wanted it. I, I snuck on. I thought my sister get lonely, so I got on. Oh hm. no! <laughs> That's but, commendable. But but why would the first mate need to sneak on board his own ship? Like I said, I was what? invited. Let's deal a so, new hand. Yeah. <laughs> we're invited to you. Snuck on board? That seems rather odd, doesn't it? Don't you think, Val? Oh, obviously the first mate just wanted to surprise his sister. Mm-hmm. Uh, you know, that does make sense. She might be too embarrassed if it was manned by her own brother. She might not want him to be on there, but her brother obviously knew what was best. It's true. I usually do. Kasim questioning the wisdom of the first maid. How dare you? Actually, I can have you thrown overboard for that. I'm sorry, I'm sorry. It's idle curiosity, nothing more. I, I, I meant no disrespect, sir. He squints at you. <laughs> <laughs> Another hand! Another hand! Right. Another hand, apparently! All right. Everybody roll me an intelligence check, please. What up? <laughs> oh, heck. Oh, damn. damn. Good. I love that y'all have inspiration and you're not using it. <laughs> it's a fair game. Yeah, <laughs> fair and square. <laughs> Fucking, do you want me to open the can of worms that is Spencer spending 10 to automatically succeed on this shit? <laughs> I start making moves that prompts other people to make moves, Karen. It's better this way. <laughs> so, fair. Val, you pull out a very, very good hand yourself. Oh. Cora beat you. <laughs> oh heck. Oh no. Uh, do I do I know if he cheated? 
I need you to roll me a perception check. Okay. Can I also Ooh. percept? Sure. If you're looking for it. Perce yeah. I'll throw an inspiration on my perception. Okay. You know what, Sam? I don't have great perception. <laughs> oh. And... Ah, come on! Oh. <laughs> oh, it didn't. I'm sorry. Let me try that again. Yeah. Just it roll another one advantage. without it. Yeah. Yeah. There we go. Slightly better. Uh, if he was shaming, you don't see any sign of it. Okay. That's fair. Mm -hmm. All right. Oh, no but you look at that. <laughs> huh. So, I get two bits of ju juicy info from the brothers, huh? Well, obviously, three. The first mate is involved. Well, I more mean, uh, you both practically share secrets, so I get two. Hmm. What would you like to know? Ask away. <laughs> <sighs> let's see, let's see, something interesting. Right. You have uh, very interesting last names. <gasps> Do we? Oh, from what I've managed to scrounge up, yes. You wouldn't happen to be related to the uh, other Kelsolador. Who's that question to? Myself mm. or Kasim? <laughs> you. He points at Kasim. Never heard of him. Is is there another Kel Zorlada? Roll a roll deception. <laughs> yeah. Roll deception oh, with disadvantage. I'm a big fan of this. <laughs> <laughs> Why is that disadvantage? Because he knows you're lying. He pretty uh, much. He pretty much knows. And why is he wasting his question? Wow. That's yeah. pretty good for what did a man and God damn. Now is is Cora oh, going to roll inside? He is, yeah. All and right. Where'd he get on that? Hmm. Uh, fucking do I? No, if he already knows. We'll see mm -hmm. that goes. Hmm. Tell you not, huh? All right. Good to know. Good to know. Then, uh, I guess my question to you, Val. But uh, who are your parents? <laughs> well, <laughs> my parents. Okay, so I am one. Just going to say it out loud. I'm going to start attempting to bullshit, but it's <laughs> going to have to roll. Uh, okay. I'm just letting you know ahead of time. This mm -hmm. is going to be followed by a deception check. <laughs> cool. <laughs> okay. Well, our father, uh, our father did not particularly have a well-respected career. And though it did bring us a fairly good amount of money, uh, my father was a jewel thief. And at one point he brought home a bit too much money and got in a particularly nasty fight with our mother. And that was his last day. I don't know if you're aware of, uh, fucking, uh, I missed the, I missed the list of old names we had for our, I was gonna try to, <laughs> I was gonna try to fucking put that in there, oh, dang. <laughs> uh, fucking, I'll make up some names. I, I didn't write them down, because I was foolish. You're a fool. <laughs> foolish fool. That's all right. Oh. Uh, heckin. Zarko and Eveline. Oh. They were our parents. Hmm. And I will throw a deception check. Please do. <laughs> uh. beep. Curses. I'm gonna portend oh. <laughs> his insight. Oh! <laughs> you giving him a one? Not one. <laughs> wow. Jesus. <laughs> Goddamn magic, man. 
He's a magic man. All I'm saying is you might have been able to save some of these portents if you made them fuck up early. <laughs> I focused on the wrong people to fuck up. <laughs> yep. Hmm. Mistakes were made. You see, yeah, oh, Kasim, <laughs> you see that he's about to, like, he gets a bit of a gleam in his eye, like, like, um, it starts to squint a little, um, like he's realizing something. In reaction to that, you're like, nope, and change, <laughs> you sort of change uh, the look in his eye to something, I guess more calm huh hmm some i guess somehow the information i gathered is a bit inaccurate then oh well sorry i just My wanted apologies. to test you too <sighs> of course of course mm. nothing wrong with a little friendly banter among shipmates of course He looks at you, Kasim. Though, and I'm, I'm <laughs> sure that you're no stranger to this, I'd prefer that you didn't spread that around too much. Oh, no, of course not. This is just between our, uh, us and the first mate here. Who it's I'm sure story. is beyond reproach. Uh, yeah, reproach. <laughs> <laughs> oh! <laughs> beyond it. <laughs> So far beyond that reproach. Oh. Ask him a question, Spencer. <laughs> Do it. <sighs> so, Lance. <sighs> Let's see. How did you get to become first mate? Uh, well, uh, it was a long, ar arduous, uh, journey. Nice. Um... Yeah, with a lot of uh, uh, a lot of fighting and and adventure, uh, I first met the captain uh, when we were both in in prison. Uh, she she was in for you know minor crimes, petty stuff. I was about to conquer the seven seas or however many seas there are, um, <laughs> and and. Uh, we met each other in, in prison. She was like, oh my gosh, you're the great Captain Lance. And I'm like, yes, but my time is over. Thus, I can o I feel only comfortable with being, you know, the 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 first mate if you ever wanted to recruit. She's like, yeah. And here we are. <laughs> also, we broke awesome. out and we got a ship. So it was good stuff. You know what, Spencer? There's something really fishy about that story. I think I want to roll insight. <laughs> <laughs> Disadvantage! <laughs> oh, the lie is too perfect! <laughs> together so flawlessly. Mm -hmm. Not a single hole to be found there. <laughs> uh, How many years ago did this happen? 30. Ah, gotcha, gotcha. Mm -hmm. That makes sense. That meant 300. I forgot to count a zero. Oh my god. Common is we all human? Do that. Yes! What? Yes, he's a human! Yes, Lance is human! <laughs> yeah, just checking to make sure I was remembering that. Yeah, man! I properly appreciate the ridiculousness of this statement. <laughs> I, I like to believe that part of his story was saying seven C's and then catching himself because he wasn't entirely sure and just saying, hey, however many. It, I mean, uh, however Ooh. many. I, I lost track. I lost track after I sailed all of them. Um, yeah. <sighs> Very good. Including all the secret C's you guys don't know about. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> all right. Let's play one more game, shall we? Sure, why not? Sounds like fun. Perfect. All right. And I need you all to roll some checks. Oh, heck. Oh, shit. Uh, yeah. Oh. 
Oh, wow. Oh, Go no. Kasim with your galaxy brain. <laughs> galaxy Save brain, us. no! No, Kasim! <laughs> <laughs> oh! Your galaxy brain! My galaxy brain has failed! Oh, no! <laughs> Win, Lance. Win! So we got you win, Lance! We got a Lance. seven from Val. Yep. A five from Kasim. Oh, a good. nine from Quora. Oh, and a 15 oh, for yes, Lance. Yes, <laughs> yes. Woo. Uh, you know, taking magic out of the equation, Lance was actually one of the better card players. <laughs> yeah. I'm so proud of him. He could have won two yeah. out of the fucking oh. two games out of all that. He's <laughs> killing what it. A good, good boy. Uh, oh. He lays down his cards. I win! Woo! <laughs> <laughs> oh, you hear that like from the top clap, deck, like, clap. what the hell is that yeah <laughs> you definitely hear all it. three of us like me Kasim and Quar are all just like yeah <laughs> oh an applause oh. roars through the ship <laughs> or at oh, least the, cutest, the cutest. at least in the uh like in the bottom <laughs> like the below the below deck there's a there's a <laughs> applause for Lance <laughs> Oh, <laughs> now the first mate is the one with the questions. <laughs> now, hmm, he looks at both of you. Which one do I want? Why are you red? Oh, Lance, you can't just ask people why they're red. <laughs> <laughs> is that directed at me? Mm -hmm. Who else would it have been wrecked to? <laughs> but I'm not red, I'm gray. Oh, right, yeah. And orange. You're mo yeah. Orange. Why are you no, all I'm... like, like that? Hmm? Why's your hair fire? Well, when you see a young man, I, early on in life, I, I looked very much like my, my brother here, under the mask, of course. And um, I, I dabbled in foul magic. I don't know what I your did. brother looks like. Uh, you can imagine. Imagine like you, but like bigger. Wow. Yeah, right. What a handsome lad. Right? Oh, God. Tell, tell <laughs> him that. I guess you're handsome. Just see. Just see. <laughs> See, the first mate thinks you're handsome. I think you should, you know, respect that authority. Thank you, first mate. I appreciate the compliment. Uh, yeah, no problem. <laughs> but yes, anyway, to answer your question, uh, I dabbled in foul magics that I should not have tread upon and ended up looking like this. Roll deception. <laughs> That's fair. <laughs> yep. That's what happens when you don't brush your teeth. Yo, oh, yeah. <laughs> Come on. <laughs> magic, you say? What kind of magic? I was attempting to, to summon a flame elemental and bind it to my will, but I ended up just binding it to my person. Wow. Huh. You suck. <laughs> Damn! <laughs> that is fair. I I mis I made a grave error, and I live with that mistake every day. You sure do. Huh. Indeed. All right. What mm. different stations we are at, Kasim. <laughs> the first mate thinks I'm handsome, and he thinks that you suck. True. Indeed. It's a shame I will have to bear. <laughs> No, Run be so dramatic. Right? Jeez. No, your words, they cut me deep, sir. I will I will endeavor to earn your approval one day. I will make up for this. Nobody likes a bootlicker. <laughs> oh my god. That's fair. That's, that's a fair thing. Yeah. Also, his dad's around a brothel. I feel like, you know, he would know that that's not true. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> Some people really like bootlicking. Uh -huh. <laughs> anyway. <laughs> you. I uh, don't know your name. 
I'm assuming he's pointing at Val. Yeah. <laughs> he, he just said, tell me your name. No, I said, he said, I don't know your said, name. I don't know your name. Oh, okay. Yeah. Would you <laughs> no. like to know it? Not as my question. Oh, mm. No, like wag a finger at him. <laughs> I'll find out through <laughs> other means. Um. Wow. Hmm. Hmm. What do your parents do for a living? Well, my father was a jewel thief, and my mother is now a murderer, so... Oh, wow. Roll deception. <laughs> I already did. Oh, that's true. What was it yeah. again? It's the same Roll one. it again. All right, fine. No, 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 no. I, I was looking at what your deception was earlier. Oh, yeah, yeah, yeah. He needs to roll insight now. Aha. Uh -huh. Ah. Oh, <laughs> yeah, Lance! Oh! Lance is a Look god of fucking the go. <laughs> mm -hmm. Man, how's Cora gonna feel about this? He couldn't see through our poker face. Right? <laughs> Hell yeah. Wait, your parent was a jewel thief and your mom was a murderer? Well, she wasn't. It's not that she was a murderer, she still is. If you do it Jesus. once, it's... You know, a thing that you have done. I don't believe you. All right. So, I don't know. It seems fishy. Yeah. Sorry. Hmm. Tell me something else. Uh, something true. Something true. Hmm. <laughs> mean. Why are you on the ship? Oh. Well, I'll, I'll like lean in across the table a little bit uh, and say like, well, as the previous bit of information was intended to be secret, I'll hope that you can keep this secret as well. But you beat me in this game, so of course I must tell you. Of course. My brother and I are headed to the Melanther Isles to try to... Uh, to try to find our mother and find all the jewels that she took from our father. <laughs> doubling down. I know he doesn't believe me, but I'm doubling down. You're not fun. If you're gonna keep lying, it's not gonna be fun. Alright, fine, fine. Here. Hold out your hand. Holding it. And I'll, like, put... My uh, index finger on the bottom side of his palm and my thumb on, uh, on like, the spot between his index finger and his thumb. And I'll put just, like, a little bit of pressure on that and be like, this is a pressure point. Oh. And if you push down hard, you can very seriously hurt someone without leaving any sort of mark. Oh, really? <laughs> Indeed. Can vouch for that one personally. It works, are you lying it to works him especially or you... well when combined with an arm bar. No look over at Kasim. <laughs> <laughs> also, are you, can't vouch. Are you are you lying to him? Or No, that's true. Okay. You can cool. actually you can actually try that yourself. That's a real okay. thing. <laughs> cool. Hey Drake! <laughs> <laughs> yeah, what he do you starts want? Walking. I gotta show you something! <laughs> I'm busy. I'm I'm all I be less bit. Hold on, I'll be right back. He goes oh, up. <laughs> he leaves. <He's>... <laughs> <laughs> Didn't oh, ask Cora or something. <laughs> <laughs> he found much more useful information. <laughs> oh no! <laughs> God damn. Uh, oh, so now, now he's a fucking, like, in the span of a day, he's a card shark, a lie detector, <laughs> and now he has learned the first stages of Hokuto no Ken. Jesus Christ. <laughs> he's gonna grow up to be a fucking open palm monk because yeah. of this. <laughs> he's gonna be the best pirate captain ever. Yeah, he is. Uh, I'm, I'm teaching this kid how to get sneak attack damage, okay? <laughs> God damn. Uh, 
This is fun. Right. <laughs> <laughs> okay. Uh, I'll start picking up my cards. All right. It's a fun game. Indeed it was. We have several more days to pass. I'm sure we might play again some point. Oh, I'm sure. He gives you sort of a, a sly grin. Mm -hmm. <laughs> I'll, I'll nod at him and go back to hanging out. All right. Kissing. Same. Cool. All right. Ormac, what are you doing? <laughs> Good question. I've been rowing the whole time, but... Uh, Anything else you want that? to do in particular, like, besides row? Uh, again, it was just like, oh, it's getting about that time. Better uh, better go make something to eat. Just stop rowing and just suddenly, like, <laughs> suddenly, like, half the boat has a little bit more power than it than it did. <laughs> we're just like, oh, God, we're going around in circles now, boys. Shit. <laughs> <laughs> we, we need someone take over for Oramek. <laughs> oh, God. Store, uh, stop fucking helping Drake and get over there. Yeah, he just is like, oh, gotta go. <laughs> okay. All right, he heads over there Fun and does out. that. All right. Yeah, as you're cooking, um, as you start prepping, you spend more time with Chandri. Uh, she's a delight to talk to. Um, oh. Let's see. Is there anything that she would talk to you about? Let me see. Um, okay. Yeah. Uh, if you're interested, uh, she'll, uh, she can tell you some things about herself if you want it. Oh. Sure. Making light conversation. Good to know your crewmates. Mm-hmm. She tells you that she is a member of the Order of the Gauntlet. Uh, oh, I like the sound of that. Mm -hmm. It's a, uh, it's a, it's a, a faction similar to the Zentarim, except they are not nearly shady. <laughs> they, it contains a, like a lot of clerics and paladins, a lot of like holy warrior types. Um, she is a, uh, she worship. She tells you she worships Helm. Um. She has come on behalf of the Church of Helm to protect the crew of the voyage on their journey. Um, let's see. But, let's see. Yeah. Yeah, she tells you she was brought up as a member of the Church of Helm and hasn't had much experience outside of the Order of the Gauntlet. Um... <laughs> <clears throat> Despite this, uh, she's eager, very eager to talk about her own experiences as well as uh, listening to others. Um, let's see. Uh, she's only young, uh, but she tells you that she was involved in the in the defense of a town named uh, Tribor uh, when it was attacked by giants. Um. And whenever, uh, when the Order of the Gauntlet saw how she helped, she was re uh, she was recruited as a squire. I uh, I know something of uh, I know something of uh, people finding you when you're young. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, it was a scary experience, but luckily Helm was there to. Uh, to help me when I most needed it. <laughs> and I've been, you know, grateful ever since. <sighs> been a day. Yeah. Um. I. Hmm? Yeah, it's nothing. Uh, just some memories. That's uh... <laughs> uh, something uh. you need to talk about, or something you want to talk about. I'm a good listener. Need and want. Need and want are different things. <laughs> yeah, they are. 
well, if you ever feel like talking about it, I'm always here to lend a ear. <laughs> and I appreciate that. Um, for the for the moment, uh, could you just hand me the, the salt that's just in the oh, back room? Uh, she goes and gets the salt. Alrighty. <clears throat> Excuse me. No excuses. Never. No. Never. Oh, oh God. Oh God. Uh, you see. Oh, um, whoever's up on the uh, uh, the upper deck. Um. So. So, Val and Kasim, did you guys go up there afterwards? Isn't it or? raining? Is it still raining? It is raining, yes. It's still, it's been <laughs> raining all day. Probably wouldn't go up there then. Yeah. Also gotcha. probably wouldn't go up there. All right. I'm trying to expose my metal to, to rusting agents. Oh, gee. be a bad scene. Mm-hmm. Uh, uh, yeah. Um... As you guys are rowing, Drake, you f you feel something on your uh, on your oar that you've been using, oh. like something grabbed it. Oh! Oh God! It's you. Am I the only? I'm, I can't be the only one holding this oar, right? Other people are holding it with me, so they would also feel it. Yeah, they'd right? also feel it. Um, cool. But you. Uh, you f at first it feels like a, a like a nudge or something, but then uh, all of a sudden it feels like something's grabbed and is trying to rip it out of your grip. Oh God! Uh, you're splashing look to from the everyone waves. Everyone else holding the oar. Uh, they all look over the 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 edge of the boat. You see this like splashing in the water. And you see uh, a dorsal fin, um, as you see a, a large shark, just oh, gr just that just grab the oar and is just trying to rip it apart. Can we try to pull it back in, like to the ship? You can. You'd have cool. to roll a strength check. <laughs> I'm gonna be using inspiration for that. <laughs> <laughs> Go ahead, roll a strength check. <laughs> Fuck. <clears throat> all right <laughs> with all the other uh sailors um uh, there with you they're like pull <laughs> it is a tough uh fight just <laughs> it basically turns into a fight of endurance as this shark is God. not intending to let go uh, after a I little bit, you finally, <laughs> you finally pull the oar out of the water. Uh, and the, the shark goes back, uh, to the water. It's, it's dorsal fin just trailing above the, uh, above the water. Huh. Uh, what the hell? The thing, uh, that thing was determined. Whew. Yeah, I, it was just a shark, right? What was that all about? I don't know. Things have been wacky all over the seas recently. Huh. Mm. But luckily, we uh, managed to get it away. Mm. Yeah, thank you, guys. Mm. Of course. Gives a gives a very dramatic <laughs> bow. <laughs> of, of course, lady. Oh. <clears throat> I'm no lady. He gives you a confused look. <laughs> don't, don't worry about it. Well, right then. Mm -hmm. ah. Um. So we should maybe keep the ore out of the water for a little bit. Yeah, may, maybe. Maybe. Yeah. Uh, we have to, we'll be a little bit slower for a little bit, but, you know, don't want to damage the ore. Mm. Or have it get dropped into the sea. Yeah. Be in a huh. worse place if that happened. <laughs> yeah. Uh, Man, a lot of these encounters are just. A lot of them get null and void with a. Mm. Uh, if you have a boat, 
Like, <laughs> yeah. <laughs> Hell yeah. Like, I get that. I roll on it. It's like, sharks. It's like, uh, yeah, man. <laughs> like, that just... Not a huge problem yeah. right now. Uh-huh. It's like, cool. <laughs> All right. Well, if we're, if we're done rowing for a bit, my brother wanted to see me for something, so I'm going to go see what he wants. <laughs> no, no. He's already <laughs> wandered up to you and did the thing. <laughs> I didn't get to roll for if you succeeded or if I believed him or anything, you son of a bitch. Uh, can we do it right now as if it was sure. just like, oh, I'm so glad we pulled the oar out. And then Lance just like walks up like, hey, 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 hey Drake, I have something to show you. Mm. Hold out your hand. Is this going to be gross? Is this gonna no, be no, 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 no. It's really cool. It's really cool. Okay. Cool. Slowly gives him her hand. Mm-hmm, mm-hmm. All right, so it's a it's a bit of a magic trick I learned from that magic guy. Um, Which magic guy? The one with, like, the fire hair. Snatch my hand back. <laughs> what did he show you? <laughs> Not th I was about to show you. It's really neat. Blaming me for this, you son of a bitch. Did you say Val? Showed it to him, that little asshole. <laughs> he did, yeah. <laughs> <laughs> <Just my nemesis. laughs> You're being a dick, dude. Don't think you suck. <laughs> Good child, protect my secrets. <laughs> <laughs> come on, come on, just, just give it, give it, give it, give it, give it, give it, give it. Fine here. Yeah. All right. First, you take your thumb, put it there. Put your two fingers there. <laughs> What what happens? <laughs> it's a pressure point. It just fucking okay, so it hurts. I was gonna say it, it just hurt, really hurts, hurts, and it also makes your grip weaker. <laughs> yeah. If if you have it applied. Oh Jesus! <laughs> <laughs> what the hell? That's not a magic trick. You're just hurting my hand, you dick. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> it's a good thing you didn't do that before the orb was grabbed. So the um, <laughs> yeah. The the guy with the fire hair taught you this. Yeah. Oh yeah, yeah. Cool. Where, 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 where is he? Uh, last I checked, he was down in the. He was down in the lower deck. Okay, cool. Cool. I'm gonna try to find Kasim. <laughs> Just cut to Kasim. Pose a card. Oh no. <laughs> <laughs> Should have saved those portents, huh? <laughs> what? Oh. Time is so nebulous. I didn't know how many things we were gonna do in a day. There he goes, making <laughs> words up again. <sighs> making up those words. Fuck. God damn it! I hate this place. <laughs> mm -hmm. uh, for the record, for YouTube watchers, when Kasim pulls from his tarot deck, Izzy has a real-world tarot deck that he's pulling from. Mm -hmm. I pulled Do the it. strength card. Oh, oh first. Okay. Oh, oh no. no, you weak bitch. <laughs> uh oh. <laughs> uh. Just in case, uh, since I'm going to find Kasim, I'm assuming that Val is with him, and they tend to talk in secret. So I'm going to cast comprehend language. <laughs> <laughs> Preemptively. Just in case. Cool. <laughs> Preemptively, yes. All right. Then cool. I'm going to go find Kasim. All right. Yep. Very easy to find him. <laughs> hey. Well, hello, Drake. How are you doing today? Not great. My hand huh? kind of really hurts, and I hear it's your fault. Oh, is that what you hear? Mm -hmm. <laughs> Mentally adding Lance to shit list. <laughs> yeah. yeah, my my little brother came up to me and said that you showed him a magic trick. That is, that gives magic a bad name. That was not me. That was Val. Is Val here? Val just turns and looks at Kasim. <laughs> <laughs> Looking at Val. What? I'm taking the fall for you. She's gonna kick my ass. <laughs> Thank you, my trustworthy brother. <laughs> For whom why, I would risk why? my life. <laughs> oh, you knew I would do the same. 
This Fair, is different. Entirely. Why are either of you teaching my brother, quote, magic tricks anyway? Oh, well, we were playing a game of cards. And as your brother had no money to bet, we were betting information. <clears throat> Eyes go wide. <laughs> yeah. What... What kind of information? Oh, I assure you, I lost most repeatedly, and he asked quite a few things of me, but my personal life was of no note to him. So I had to teach him something else that seemed interesting. So I just taught him a few things about pressure points. So you taught him how to really fucking hurt my hand? Well, he was the one who chose to use what I taught him. You have a brother. You know how this works. I suppose I do. <laughs> Just giving like such a shit eating grin, like <laughs> yeah. All right. Well, that seems kind of unfair because I promised that I wouldn't use your brother to get information about you. So what did you find out about well, me? Well, you only promised to do that after you used my brother to get information about me. He barely gave me anything. He just gave me that he was your brother, so... Sure, in the part where he was constantly babbling any number of things, you get, he gave you nothing. That mm -hmm. was when I asked if brothers were off limits. Regardless, what do you know? Well, I did win at least one game, and I got a bit of information. Now, I still don't know what you do for a living, but I have been made aware of what your fathers do. Hmm. And it does explain why I couldn't quite pinpoint what you did for a living. Do you have a suspicion of what I do for a living? To be honest... I think you might not have a thing you do for a living, but I'm not honestly sure. Okay. I think you might not have a job, because your fathers might provide you enough money. Hmm. Is that right? It's possible. He's smiling at you. I believe it. <laughs> I believe she's smiling. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. Yeah, I checked. Anyway, don't teach my brother how to hurt people, okay? God. What's your stance on card it's already tricks? Worse. Like, is that off limits? Using what cards? I mean, looks at your tarot deck. <laughs> <laughs> Puts him behind my back. I don't see how that's relevant. Mm hmm. How about y'all just don't teach my brother anything? Hmm? Mm. Sure. If that's what you want, sure, sure. Thank you. And then I'm gonna leave. Cool. <laughs> I very much thought that that card game would go differently. Kind of saying we're usually better at scamming people, right? Yeah, we usually are. Goddamn, I... You gotta come up with some new ones or something. That is, ugh. That's bad next time I'll. Enough. Next time I'll have to cheat. Mhm. Mm I, you know, I was kind of thinking of this thing where I'd have Reginald kind of like stand behind the dude with a mirror, but like I kind of thought that would be a little ostentatious. That there would be a floating mirror behind a person playing cards with you? Yes, I believe that might be, perhaps a little bit easy to perceive. A <laughs> little bit, a little bit. That's why I'm, I'm workshopping it. I'll think of something else. I'm sure you'll get there. <sighs> so, how do you feel about her? Do you think she's trying to get information? Do you think she might have some sort of alternative? Oh, she's definitely ideas? trying to get information. Her motives are a little harder to read, but... I don't know. I don't really get a sinister vibe from her. I, I don't think, uh... I'm not getting the feeling we have a ton to worry about there. I think her interests may be mostly personal. Um, mm. 
I doubt that her brother has also been planted to get information about us. I don't think he's been altered through any sort of magical means to have a disguise. <laughs> so I think it is possible that there might be nothing going on. Especially what? if Cora didn't know anything. You mean, it might be possible that not everyone is out to get us? <clears throat> what? We don't know that for sure, but perhaps there are some that don't have immediate interest in what we're doing. <laughs> Look, all I'm saying is you could stand to be like a few, like maybe dial it down like 20% on the paranoia. Not everyone is a threat to you. <laughs> you could stand to have a little more fun. Hmm, you're oh. right. Maybe I shouldn't focus on Drake as much. Quora now is aware of my appearance. He could use that against me. Wow. Yeah, like, may seem obvious, but yeah, Quora does seem kind of like the more obviously threatening one of the two. Hmm. Do you Not think really. he's trying to get information on us? He already knew about a couple of things. <sighs> I think he knows a lot more than he should, and he was trying to confirm a lot of it. I'm not sure how much we were able to throw him off the scent, but the kid may have tipped our hands a bit. Hmm. Indeed. I'm gonna check real quick. What's what's Drake doing? I'm gonna go find Lance. Oh, okay, so you're not you're not like around this area. Cool. Just <laughs> making sure. Making sure seeing if you drop any eaves. I was thinking about dropping eaves, but I also really want to hit lanes. <laughs> <laughs> so I'm debating which one she wants more. Totally fair. Mm -hmm. I might hang out for like a minute after I leave, but I think I just heard you guys talking about like, man, we suck at card <laughs> games. And I'm like, they're not talking about anything interesting. And then I take off. <laughs> yeah. Entirely sure. Yeah. All right, we'll keep your guard up. We don't necessarily know that any of these people aren't out to get us. Any one of them could be plotting something. It's true. Not sure how likely that is, but they could be plotting something. All right. I feel like your guard is dropping, Kasim. Oh, no, I've no. asked you explicitly to keep it up. <laughs> yes, yes, I'll keep my head on a swivel. Hmm. I wonder what that mm. Shandry girl is doing. Oh. What, what did you say? I it. I was like, I wonder what that Shandry girl is doing. She could be up to something. <laughs> Everyone nice. could be up to something, She now. seems too nice. <laughs> but sometimes people are just nice. You know that, right? Like, in your heart. Like, not everyone is scheming and plotting at all times. Some people... Just do things genuinely? Who have you met that does things genuinely? I mean, there are a couple Name girls someone. here and there. Go, go, I'll wait. Name <laughs> Stephanie, someone. Vanessa, Veronica, Betty. Ew, Betty. <laughs> <laughs> How do you know that they weren't after something? Oh, they were after something, all right. Oh, <laughs> <laughs> you seem you're disgusting. <laughs> come on, come on! You, you just leave that out there. Like, come on, come, no, come on. <sighs> Up top. Up top. I'm gonna leave you hanging. You gonna, <gasps> you're, gonna, you're gonna leave your brother hanging? It is I a was sacred about to leave trust. It's about to leave you hanging off the side of the ship. Damn. <laughs> I need to clean the sails. <laughs> well, it seems like an unnecessary escalation. That's all I'm saying. You used magic to render me unconscious. <laughs> yeah, for like the 400th time. Does that still sting? One of these days it's not gonna work, Kasim. <laughs> we'll and on see. that day, a reckoning will come. Cast sleep. <laughs> You're casting sleep? I'm casting sleep right now. Oh, heck. oh my god. Roll those Roll D8s. <laughs> 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 so 
back here. How many is it again? Fuck. It's 5d8. 5d8. Holy shit. <laughs> You're knocked Damn. out. Damn! <laughs> I was, I was fucking gonna say it's like a 20 foot radius sphere effect when you cast it. So I'm like, oh, maybe I don't have the lowest health. Maybe it, maybe I'll be okay. But then like that much. Yeah. Dude, fucking if Dragon just been eavesdropping and just fucking hits her too. She's knocked the fuck out outside the door. And like four people around no, us no, just collapse. Well, to be fair, yeah. you have more health than Val. No, I love Ooh, yeah. no way. Yeah, thick boy. Cool. How many people are within the radius of this? <laughs> I'm attempting to target an area that's just you. That's totally fair. Mm -hmm. You can mm. do that, yeah. All right. <laughs> Make sense to just reach into my bag, grab like a bunch of flower petals and blow them in your face. <laughs> as you as you reach into your bag, I like go to draw my sword. And go, Kasim's not... <laughs> <laughs> and then I gently pick him up, put him in one of the hammocks, and tuck him in. <laughs> and I kiss him on the forehead and walk away. <laughs> That's the cutest. Oh my god. <laughs> one of these Sean. days, there's just gonna be like a common meme of like Val in the Yamcha pose after the Cybermen. <laughs> <laughs> and you just like all these little flower petals scattered around. <laughs> uh, I'm just picturing I'm gonna do it so often that you're just legitimately gonna just develop narcolepsy. Yeah. I'm just trying to picture how many levels it's gonna be before that stops working. It's gonna be so many levels. Uh, and that's just that's not even upcasting it. Yeah, that's just for oh. Chandri and Oramaki Jesus. both see that transpire. <laughs> uh, or Oramaki sees it. Chandri mm -hmm. also sees mm -hmm. it. Wow. That's, That's... Uh... Brothers. Yeah. I'm, I'm glad I didn't have one. <laughs> Aww. Huh. All right, <laughs> and yeah. Kasim, it's... didn't you want to go? I, I, I was gonna wander off and look for her. <laughs> look for who? Drake. Oh, okay. Uh, Chandra. Chandra. Oh, Chandra. oh yeah, she's right there. Yeah. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> like walking past her with like your brother like slumped over your shoulder, like, hey there. <laughs> yeah. Yeah. <laughs> yeah, I put him in a bunk that's like two feet away from you guys. Uh, Jesus. Is, uh, is he okay? Oh, yeah, he's just taking a little cat nap. He's all tuckered out. Okay. How long does sleep last? <laughs> One okay. minute. A minute, yeah, there you go. <laughs> well. <laughs> I'd love okay. to talk to you guys somewhere not here that he can't see. <laughs> uh. Wow. Sure, uh, okay. Shit. <laughs> <laughs> What do you need to talk I'll, about? I'll... Oh, I just wanted to. <clears throat> was, uh, I was curious to, to meet some of the the crewmates. I think we've uh, we've run into each other once or twice. I'm I'm not sure I got your name. Oh, uh, I'm I'm Chandri, uh, Shand Chandri Dundragon. Oh, nice to meet you, Miss Dundragon. Uh, I'm uh, Kasim. Oh, wonderful to meet you. Yeah. What uh, what brings uh, what brings you two on this fine vessel? You hear a stirring behind you. We should we should uh, walk and talk, walk and talk. Well, uh, <laughs> okay. <laughs> we'll talk to you later, Chandri. Uh, bye. <laughs> so, <God>. damn. <laughs> Value stir away. <laughs> uh, okay. At which? Okay, I'm. I'll fucking fucking stir awake. Kasim! <laughs> <laughs> like, hop out of the hammock and, like, look around. It's like in a, in a stance, ready to take action. He doesn't see him there. He's not there, oh, yeah. yeah. Hey there, sleepyhead. How are you feeling? Val will, like, try to compose himself and walk over to Oramac. Oramac, hello. Yes, I'm, I'm fine. 
Have you seen my brother anywhere? Uh, yes, he, he just put you to bed and, uh, and left with Chandri. I see. I see. And, and where, where did they leave to? Wow. Um, uh, what, what direction did they, uh, they head off in? Like, did uh, they go just like, up top, top or? They, you just there's only him. really, there's really only one direction to go. <laughs> I mean, they went over there. Thank you, Oromac. I greatly appreciate you. I, hey, I'm no going to go attend to something quickly. I will hopefully be right back. Yeah, that, that sounds wonderful. That was, and, it was good and you know what? Thank you. Thank you so oh. much for making so many meals for the crew. I, I understand that wasn't particularly your job, but I appreciate the work you've put in. Ah, uh, well, that's, uh, someone needs to do it, and I've got the skill set. Yes, thank you so much. Speaking of having a skill set and things needing to be done, and I'm going to cunning action fucking dash. <laughs> <laughs> Dead sprint away. While that was happening, uh, Kasim <laughs> and John Drew were walking together. Uh, what did, what did oh. you ask her? I think I was asking, so what brings you on this uh, this fine ship? Oh, uh, I'm, I'm here to... Uh, uh, take care of the the passengers if they get sick or injured or anything. Oh, that's uh, right. Yeah, you uh you healed up uh, Miss Drake when she was injured in that pirate attack. That was very well done. Thank you. There's uh, <laughs> it's been a very large, uh, very strange influx of pirate attacks. So uh, I'm also here as a bit of protection, I guess. Um, I see. Yeah, my well, my nice the to... order. My order uh, uh, tasks me with this, so, yeah. Well, I, I know I certainly feel more secure in your care. Uh, thank you, I guess. <laughs> Very nice of you to say. No problem. Skill deserves to be recognized. Mm. <laughs> 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 ah, yeah. we should. Uh, we should walk faster, I think. Uh, so, like, where, where are you from? We're at, like, the edge of the boat. <laughs> we all are, aren't we? Uh-huh. <laughs> cool. Cool. So, like, you're, you're, like, a he... Like, you're here to defend the passengers, right? If they get hit... If they are attacked by pirates. Specifically Cassie! pirates. <laughs> so that's specifically pirates like there's no wiggle room on that Kasim, you turn it's getting fairly <laughs> dark out you see just <laughs> it's a very a shadowy figure <laughs> just staring you down a flash of lightning strikes behind <laughs> illuminating his figure yes <laughs> Oh my god. You know what? I would love to pick this up later, but I think my brother has something he wants to discuss with me. That was spooky. Oh my god. Did he plan that? Oh my I gosh. honestly <laughs> wouldn't be surprised. He has his ways. All right. You have fun with that. <laughs> you too. It's been great. I'd love to talk more later if I survive the next five minutes. Goodbye. Bye. <laughs> <laughs> Fucking the sprint. second Kasim starts moving, Val starts moving it. <laughs> oh my god. Val, Val, be reasonable. You seem tired. I was just trying to help. I am going to try to the best of my ability to throw a dagger at his component pouch as to remove it from his person. Oh, you bitch. <laughs> Roll me a... Uh... Roll me an attack roll with your dagger. Spencer, I'd like to spend 10. <laughs> Should have saved that portent. <laughs> oh! Like, it's weird in this situation, but I can't read the future, guys. <laughs> <laughs> oh. Should have pulled more cards just to double check. Kasim starts reaching for the component pouch. Very like Western movie, like standoff. Fucking Val pulls out a goddamn dagger, just throws it through. Oh, throws it at the strap. 
uh, uh, that holds Kasim's component pouch. <laughs> Drops to the ground. I'm, I'm gonna uh, move in. <laughs> <laughs> Freaking, I like produce flames to fireball and start bouncing it back in my hands. <laughs> we, don't do this, man. we don't, we don't gotta do it like this. <laughs> Oh, don't we, Kasim? <laughs> I really feel like we can talk this out, like, as adults, brother to brother. I'm gonna try to move in and snag the component pouch so we can't use it. <laughs> Fuck, I'm gonna die for the component pouch. I need you both to roll <laughs> dexterity checks. Oh, hell yeah. Ah, uh, dexterity, this is gonna be bad! <laughs> <laughs> Ah, oh, damn! Oh, nice. Kasim is able to grab it right at, uh, right before Kas uh, Val is able to uh, grab it. It's in your hands. <laughs> oh. <laughs> I make sure to, to hook it back on and start backing away from him. Where are you backing to, Kasim? <laughs> Where are we on the ship right now? Like, are we on the deck? Are we underneath the? Uh, you're like on the deck. Mm. On to up top. Yeah, you're up top. You guys, gotcha. you guys are like very close to like the edge of the boat, like the front. Uh, yeah. You very effectively cornered. Gotcha, yourself, gotcha. You, you are <laughs> almost not cornered. A lot, not a lot of places to run here. It's not a huge ship. <laughs> That's yeah. true. Uh, you can hide. <laughs> yeah, that'll be real easy for me. <laughs> I fucking glow. <laughs> I'm just trying to help you out, man. <laughs> fucking whatever. Get murdered for all I care. <laughs> the only thing I can think to do is sleep, and that'll only delay the problem. <laughs> that is true. <laughs> God. Exacerbated, even. Mm -hmm. anyway, it may You're as well. Quick just on the draw, Kasim. <laughs> I'll give you that. I'm gonna try and make a break for it. I'm just gonna try and like run past him <laughs> for what it's worth. I gotta at least make an attempt. I'm gonna try to grapple him. Uh, okay. Roll me athletics where Kasim either roll athletics back or acrobatics. Let's see. Definitely Oof. acrobatics. Be bad rolls today, baby. Booty. Get out of there, Kasim. Ah. <laughs> uh. <laughs> You try to grab him as he runs by, but he slips out of your fingers, uh, probably due to how, how wet it is up here. I know all your moves, brother! I've seen them in the stars! Obviously, when we grew up together. <laughs> oh, God. Uh, where are you going? I'm just running as wherever there is open space away from you. I'm just running as fast as I can. You, uh, oh. you start running. Um, not exactly like looking where you're going, just sort of in a panic, trying to find anything. You run into somebody. I'm. I was gonna say on a side note, the thing I'm looking to do, which uh is maybe gonna be tricky based on our positioning, but I would like to try to roll a deception check to act like I have never been pursuing Kasim and that I've been politely talking to Chandri. <laughs> wow. How the fuck? How? <laughs> I I want to just like if I I'm looking for the captain specifically. So, if I if I see her, I want to try to just look like I haven't been doing anything. <laughs> she and the has, is just freaking out. She has been present. Uh That's fair though. Okay. Mm. If she's been there the whole time, then never mind. Yeah, she's been up on the top okay. of the deck. Like, never mind. You, uh, you, you both have very much been gathering a lot of attention. I get yep. that. I very I'm, much get that. I'm Continue. Kasim, you run into somebody. Oh, no. You get knocked down. You look up to see Captain Graysail staring <laughs> down at you. <laughs> Are you five? <laughs> He started it. Yeah, you're fine. Wow. <laughs> <laughs> like, I, I was just making an honest effort to defend myself. Enough. I, my brother didn't want to take a Enough. nap. Enough. 
Ayun, okay. Are you more trouble than you're worth? Oh, I get that question a lot. I wasn't expecting sass, nor do I desire it. Sorry, I just kind of exude it. It's a problem. I can't turn I it off. I am aware. It's a, it's a condition, I think. Perhaps genetic. Stop. I honestly don't know I'm doing it. I'm sorry. Uh, I'll come over and put <laughs> like my hand on Kasim's mouth. Uh, and go, I'm sorry, Captain, for our ridiculous display and for Kasim. Control uh, him. I will attempt to do so. You have my apologies. And yourself. Of course. This is your last warning. Understood. Yes, Captain. She glares at you, Kasim. <laughs> I just give her, like, my attempt at, like, Puss in Boots innocent eyes. Aww. <laughs> You don't have near the charisma you need for that, boy. <laughs> no, you should at least let me try. You, nope. <laughs> you aren't capable of it. Wow. <laughs> That's some bullshit. This is my yes, Spencer. After all the shit you've done, <laughs> you do not have the capability. You need like a 35 to pull off that shit. It, <laughs> like, it's well. within the rules we set up of spending 10. You have to be able to reasonably <laughs> succeed at it. <laughs> I honestly don't expect it to work. I just wanted to see what I would roll. <laughs> like how Come badly on. it would backfire? <laughs> yeah. Mm -hmm. uh. And she goes back to what she was doing before. Leaves you both to your devices. What was she doing before? She she was just um, helping out around the around the boat, trying to keep it in uh, keep in working order, telling people what to do, what not. Okay. Can you please stop making me chase after you in front of the captain? I'd like to have plausible deniability. I mean, I'm not making you do anything. We are masters of our own destiny, dear brother. Is that so? So you're not making me suddenly fall unconscious. I just do that myself because I'm the master of my own destiny. I mean, yes, I chose to make you fall asleep, but you could have chosen to take that in good humor and just take a nice nap. So you could, in exchange, choose to apologize and stop doing that. <clears throat> <laughs> like, given, like, a quick, like, glance at, like, the captain. Suppose that might be considered fair. I... I... I'm, I'm sorry. Thank you, O oh master of your destiny. Now, please, can we stop being around the captain? We I would very much have like... have a reason I... to be thrown off the ship. She... It's like she appears out of nowhere. Like, I think she can teleport. She senses tomfoolery, cause, <laughs> Val. Mm-hmm. And it's not all the screaming and running around that we keep doing. <laughs> no, no, clearly magic is afoot. Oh, surely, I, you must be correct. Mm-hmm, mm -hmm. Yes, I can sense these things. All right. Stars. <sighs> Go apologize to Chandri as well, please. <laughs> yeah, I, sh I, sh I should do that. That probably looked a little weird. But he like put like an honest hand on like your shoulder, like I am sorry. I I don't want to get us kicked off of this ship. It's too important. I agree, and I would also not like to have to pursue escalation like we used to. Yeah. I don't want to have to draw some sort of weapon on you, Kasim. <laughs> not again. <laughs> sorry. <laughs> I'll try to remember we're not back home anymore. As will I. <laughs> and I'll go off to apologize to Chandra. You do so. Uh, okay. And from there, let's go ahead and take a break. Woo! Hooray! 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 
Mansion game session two. Apparently. <laughs> Apparently. Uh, okay. I will be right back. I'm going to use the restroom. Hooray! We appear to have gotten some heckin' donations, apparently. Heck. Oh my god, Jin did it! Oh no! Badland I gotta it. find it! <laughs> oh. <laughs> oh hey, we got the same one from Krebozy. They Kray They both... Oh, Krebozy. So oh, now, so good. Good. now we have two of them. <laughs> Fucking, I love the I love the hubris one as well. Of like, when she was nine, Drake ate a bug. <laughs> it uh, looks so sinister. Uh, 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 Tan and Tannis did one earlier that was just uh, uh, Drake. Oh, I sense a disturbance in the force. Oh, I love both of these pictures so much of the fucking. <laughs> Val, They're so thoroughly prone. <laughs> I love being your brother. It's, it's such a fucking time. <laughs> I, I also like King Night Owl's uh fucking gif for Val. That's just the Linkara like yes, the Terminator run. Yeah. Oh, I love it. <laughs> Val running to seem like. Mm -hmm. <laughs> oh, what a good time. <laughs> We're too good at fucking with each other's characters. And it's too much fun not to do. It's a problem. <laughs> Goddamn. Fuck it. That's such a... I gotta not abuse that. It's too much fun <laughs> to put, cast sleep on someone mid-conversation. Mm -hmm. <laughs> it's so good. <laughs> oh. I was... <laughs> I, I I didn't want to say anything during the conflict, but I there was a question I had of like, yeah. did he get rid of that fireball or was it like, ha, I got the pouch. Sets the pouch on fire. <laughs> no! That would have been bad. <laughs> like you still have the fireball in your hand. That would have been so bad. Because like, my hair might not burn shit, but produce flame sure as hell will. It really, really does. <laughs> Oh, apparently the chat has decided that Lance is the new jib. That makes sense. He deserves to be worshipped. Yes. Well, Religion 2 electric boogaloo. Yeah. But I mean... Yeah, but I mean, doesn't that also mean that, like, Lance is deaf gonna die right. if he's the new no. jib? No. No, that's ridiculous. What do you mean? Um, I'm sure there's no death flags trying to deify a child. No. Oh. So fucking good. This is fucking ridiculous. <laughs> Such ridiculous shenanigans that our characters get into. And fucking Oromac is just politely minding his own business the whole time. Just the three of you just, like, fucking stirring up shit, and he's stirring up stir-fry. I know. It's, he's too good for this shit show of a party. <laughs> Who wants food? He <laughs> cuts to fucking Val passed out, Drake <laughs> gripping her arm after Lance has, like, paralyzed her. <laughs> Kasim's trying to flirt with people using tarot cards. <laughs> <laughs> Oh. Uh. What a good time. I love our boys so much. They're so much fun. So, so much. I think the one <laughs> thing that I don't like about our boys is that they're too conversational. We can't just let time pass normally and just be like, and we're there, and now let's go into combat and level up. <laughs> we're not playing the D and D part of D and D. We're just fucking role playing. I know. We, we're gonna be on this boat. Oh, we're never gonna leave this boat, y'all. <laughs> oh, seven years later, and we get off the boat. Oh, oh my God, dead art! Oh my God, Krabosi art! Hubris it's art! So oh good. my God, there's, there's so much. There's there's two. Uh, there's at least two pieces of din art. <laughs> 
There's there's one she did Fucking earlier. Dra- I sense a disturbance in the noise. Yeah. <laughs> oh, night shadow dragon. Goddamn. Oh heck. Oh. Goodness, night shadow dragon slayer. Be be real oh, bad. Why did why did gifted ten tier one yeah, songs? So you're saying this is bird Jeez. <laughs> Oh my god. Oh my god, what a good good time. So good. Such a good good time. It's so upsetting because I want to like talk about things, but I'm also very like, we need to stop mm-hmm. talking and play the game. Listen, we'll just make Spencer's job ridiculously easy and just keep role playing <laughs> the entire game. The entire campaign. There's no battle. Oh. <laughs> uh. The social stakes. Are Lan- Lance is your god now, space. Yeah, they started a religion. What? Oh no! No! He doesn't need that. <laughs> god damn He's it! He's a deity now. We all know it. No, he's a little shit. The god of little shits. No. I am proud of him for winning, though. Oh, I good know. He did so good. But he doesn't, he doesn't deserve God tier, though, that... Dude, I'm terrified of what fucking Quora would have asked us about after that, like, last round. Dude! Like, I was fucking sitting there when he was like, I know things about Drake, and I was like, how in the fuck?! And then I was like, he's been hanging out with Lance. He's got this information from Lance since all this is. Like, yep. (laughs) Bastard. What a good time. It was like, I've been avoiding that son of a bitch mm-hmm. on purpose. <laughs> he should know nothing. Fucking Lance. Lance uh, is so powerful. Cannot Lance giveth and Lance taketh Too away. Powerful. Too powerful, one might say. I wouldn't. The right amount That's of powerful. All right. yeah. How dare you. Perfect. God damn it, dare you. <laughs> Unfair. Her game is all out of whack, Chase. <laughs> it's bullshit. I love that we've both set up these characters and neither of them can actually do what they thought they would be able to do. <laughs> no! It's so good. So good! The uh... roleplay between, like, just Drake and Val with no outside influence would be such a different fucking game. You yeah, right? Shit. Like, if Lance and fucking Kasim just weren't there, be like, hmm. <laughs> like, oh. Playing, like, fucking 4D chess, trying to figure out each other's Attempting most minute you. details. Ridiculous. <laughs> <laughs> oh, what a good, good time. It's like over the most stupid tiny details, we're both like, ha I got you! Like fucking, yeah! like, I, I just like pass you a potato or something, and I'm like, hey, Oromax said that you need to chop this up, and you're like, okay, and you just like grab a knife and go to like cut it, and I'm like, aha! You are left handed! I knew it all along! Okay, I'm back. Yeah! <laughs> oh. so good! So many gift subs, oh my god. Okay. I know, He's Night Shadow Dragon Slayer was so hard. Beans, did you see all the art? Uh, I've seen two pieces of art. Thank you so much. Oh my god. (laughs) (laughs) Kravos and Dindru the same thing. (laughs) I know. I know, it's perfect. Oh, I love it. Mm -hmm. Oh, it's so good. It's so good. That is like an emote. (laughs) Oh, I love the King Hubris Mm -hmm. art. It's like, when she was nine, Drake ate a bug. (laughs) Drake Uh, ate a bug. (laughs) The little fucking uh, The chat has apparently started a religion for Lance Spencer. Yes. Ah, I see. Yes, they have. I oh. most decidedly have. <laughs> it's good good for them. <laughs> oh. Uh okay. Let's did you guys already go through the donations? No. No, I don't think we have. Okay, no. Well. well, there are a couple. Um let's see. Ooh. Let's see. Uh we already got the yeah, we did that one. Okay, Mabregardus donated $20 uh, huh. two hours ago, saying, In honor of today, the day of my sub-baby's birth, I donate oh. four inspiration oh. to carry. Oh. oh my gosh! Oh, thank you so much! Thank you, Jim. 
This Thank one's you, very... you and Baby Hot Wheels. Mm -hmm. This one is very simple. Super Iron Man donated $75. Oh, says, oh, oh, easy. Oh, <laughs> oh my goodness. God. Thank you. That's God 15 is. inspiration. Uh, Tucker what White donated fuck? one dollar. Says, I never no. thought watching people play Dungeons and Dragons would be interesting, no. but watching y'all made uh y'all play made me realize what an excellent source of background noise it provides. While I read some Black mm. Lagoon. Oh, that's nice. nice. Hell yeah. Hey Tucker, if you're still in the chat, did you want that one dollar to go to me? No. Uh, because it's it's only no. <laughs> only place it can go. Like, no. Yeah, but no. Is he shut up? It could go nowhere. Yeah, it could go nowhere. Could go That's nowhere. why I'm asking. And I am back. Did I miss any uh, donations for uh, for Oramac? We were going over them. No. None for Matt Oramac just yet. Um, cool. Let's see. My name is Klein. Donated fifty dollars. Says okay. Taval. Uh, that was oh. a beautiful use of inspiration. Have ten more. Absolutely, oh. your uh, your guys' relationship. Uh, absolutely mm. love your guys' relationship. Aww. Thank you so much. Aww. Oh yeah! Don't worry, I'll beat him up real soon. Uh, Get him! Yeah, Cut off all his goddamn yeah. head! Oh, yeah, that's no. all the donations we got. I need my head. Hell you! Oh. My beautiful flamey head. <laughs> uh, Spencer, uh, I know that this doesn't work for like background stuff or like backstory reasons or physically or through mm -hmm. any means that could be described. But could I suddenly just like spontaneously become elvish on Val so that I'm immune to sleep effects? <laughs> no! <laughs> oh man, suddenly Val has pointed ears and uh, is, is a lot leaner. Uh, <laughs> Ooh. Try to sleep me now, brother! <laughs> uh, uh, I don't know. It's a good time. <laughs> You're a good time, got him. Uh -huh. All right. Is everyone back? Uh, everyone ready uh, to go? Much, yeah. No. Thanks, so. All right. Well. Okay. <laughs> yep. Yeah. All no, right. Then. Good. Let's get back to the game. Woo. Okay. All right. Go back, chat. I love you so. Goodbye. No, Goodbye, chat. Woo. Woo. All right. So. Woo. Um. Yeah, uh, Kasim, you were off to go apologize to apologize to uh, Chandri. We yeah. can just say that you did that. If you want to roleplay further, that's up to you, but I'm cool with just letting it be as you apologized to her. <laughs> I, I would like to see how she reacts. Okay. Yeah. Um, all right, so you, you go over and apologize. Walk over to her. Okay. I'd like to apologize for that. Uh, sorry for the for the disturbance. Oh, it's it's fine, I guess. Uh, you guys are very lively. Yeah, have a hard time reading it in sometimes. It seems. <laughs> seems. Uh, Captain's a bit scary. <laughs> little bit, Maybe. little bit. I have mm -hmm. a bad habit of getting on her bad side. I uh. <laughs> it's a. Uh, it's a problem. <laughs> gonna kick uh, me off this ship. Uh, don't do that. Uh, there's not a lot of places to get kicked off from, and the place that can kick you off, is, you don't want to be in. Oh, I know, I know. Like it's, it wouldn't be by my choice at all. Definitely, it's just, I don't know if I have it within. I don't know if I have it within me to stop it. It just leaks out of me, Chandra. I'm just nothing but sass and chaos. <laughs> Maybe you should fix that. Just like give her like a oh baby, <laughs> like no. <laughs> if that were possible, someone would have tried that. <laughs> she raises one eyebrow. Okay, sure. <laughs> Great people have tried to rein in this and gone mad in the attempt. Hmm. Wow, you're gross right now. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> Rolling an insight check. <laughs> How into you is she? Yeah. <laughs> My God. 
<laughs> super into you, man. This is going exactly how you want it. <laughs> God damn. Oh, she's loving this. She oh, is yeah. a fan. You know? <laughs> oh, I don't know how many of you have seen The Office. I know Carrie's seen it all the way through. But... Oh, I've seen uh, it. Not... Yeah, you've seen it too, yeah. Yeah, I've okay. seen bits and pieces, not, not even like a full episode. Rem uh, I guess for Izzy and Carrie, you remember that episode where, mm -hmm. like, um, Jim messes with Andy by telling, by telling him all of Pam's, like, things that she hates the by and he tries to hit on her with all the things that she hates yeah <laughs> oh no oh good luck izzy <laughs> not even trying to like hit on her yeah but you're rubbing her the wrong way that's the vibe <laughs> that's the vibe though <laughs> that's how she's taking it that's how she's taking it <laughs> Legitimately talking about like, yeah, I'm a fucking problem. People you used the phrase all of this. Yeah, <laughs> like, you did, dude. <laughs> you meant it in a like gesturing at a dumpster fire kind of way, not in a look at my dick kind of way. <laughs> shame. Uh, That's a shame. Sadly, the nuance was lost on her. Mm-hmm. Mm -hmm. God damn. You can save uh, it. Come on. Yeah. So, <laughs> yeah. Keep trying. I, uh. Sorry, I need to be better about that in the future. I'd, we're all stuck on this boat together, and I don't want to keep causing everybody problems. I, uh. Just kind of jumping off the walls, and. Um, I, I apologize. Uh. It's fine. Just uh, try not to get kicked off. If, well, not for you, but for your brother. Yeah. Can't really leave that one alone. <laughs> See shadows around every corner. Mm-hmm. He's, he's a good guy. Should, uh, should try talking to him at some point. He's a little scary. A little scary looking. I get, I get that. It's 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 entirely on purpose. It's just for show, though. I, I wouldn't I wouldn't worry too much. So. <laughs> okay. I'll yeah. yeah. I'll try and do that. Yeah, he's an interesting guy. Give, give him a chance. He could he could use some more friends. <laughs> Let him know that not everyone is out to get him. Mm hmm. <laughs> okay. Oh. So... Well, I'll try and talk to him when I get the chance. Heck yeah. All right. I'm going to head back down. I got some stuff I need to get done. That's fair. That's fair. I've uh, taken up enough of your time. <laughs> I'll uh, see you around. Slight bow. She <laughs> bow heads back. Off. Hmm? Oh, I'll bow back. Okay. She'll mm. head back down. All right. <clears throat> so, yeah, what up? I have a dumb, 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 dumb question. What dum, is your dumb, dumb, dumb Where's, where is the, where, where is the captain? Where is the captain? She's yes. up, uh, she's on the uh, upper deck. I would like to go talk to the captain. <laughs> <laughs> okay. Very well, then. <laughs> so you have chosen hmm. death. Yup! Here I go! <laughs> Alright, you approach the captain. Uh, she seems to be helping some uh, one of the other sailors out, moving some uh, some storage and whatnot. Oh, I'm gonna, uh, I'm gonna help if I can. Uh, thanks. Here, let me, let me help you with that, captain. Got, got you. Thanks. Mm -hmm. She'll bring it over to where it needs to be. Uh, so, what do you need? I, I I don't really need anything. I just I wanted to tell you that I think you're doing a really good job. It's got to be hard. Female captain leading a bunch of bunch of guys. I think you're doing great. Huh. 
That could be a rowdy bunch, but I can whip him into shape pretty we uh, pretty easily. Mm -hmm. <laughs> like I could tell. Yeah. Yeah, it's a. Uh, <laughs> I've been I've been captaining the ship for a while. But, oh yeah. Hmm. Yeah, I have uh, a couple years now, probably. But specifically, this ship, or have you have you captained other vessels? Uh, this ship in particular. Give me a sec. <laughs> well, I check my backstory. I'm checking my, uh, her, her whole thing here. <laughs> She's her like fucking her. searching her fucking. Hmm. Searching her notes. <laughs> She's searching her notes. Mm -hmm. uh, she pulls out a notebook on herself. Uh, I don't know. Uh, what um... have I done? Uh, yeah. <laughs> <laughs> You're all joking, but that's the secret twist is that she has like Alzheimer's. Oh no! <laughs> oh no! A, a sad, tragic twist. <laughs> uh, but uh, yeah, I've been I've been uh, captain of this ship for a couple years now. It's got to be stressful. Can be sometimes. But I think I've done pretty well. Oh, oh no, uh, you've done exceptionally yeah. well. <laughs> yeah. Uh, specifically, uh, mm. she's been captain for nearly a decade. So, damn, that's more than a couple of years. Yeah. Mm. Hmm. <laughs> yeah, I can see why you'd need to drop by the hidden snake. A little bit of stress relief, if you know what I'm saying. <laughs> Yeah, it can be uh, yeah. difficult out on the sea for extended periods of time. And I, I all you. of these guys are off limits. So, Like just to you? To me. Or like in general? I don't care what you do. Okay. Cool. 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 <clears throat> why, so why exactly are they off limits to you? Is that just like a personal rule or is it like a, a, like a rule? Rule. rule. Oh. It's uh, an unwritten rule, I guess, among among vessels. You don't shit where you eat. That's a very good rule. Mm. It's very, very good advice, Captain. <laughs> yeah. <sighs> Is there anything else you? Yeah on on your on your. On your visit to the Hidden Snake, you you spent some time with Himmo, huh? I did. Do you know him? Well, my my family runs the brothel, so like I know uh, like all the employees. So yeah. <laughs> I see. Do, do you mind if I ask you something personal? Just like a, like a work related thing. She gives. She raises an eyebrow. Like. Sure. Like, during your session with him, he didn't, like, he, he didn't, like, kiss you, like, on your, on, on the lips on your face, right? I'm not, <laughs> I, uh, I had to hold back. Uh, my face, huh? Ho, ho, ho. Uh... <laughs> Just because we, he's he's done it once or twice in in the past, and like you know that can. For what most people come to our establishment for, that can be seen as kind of like a little too intimate. So we've we've had one or two complaints about him in in the past. I just wanted to check. Have you now? Mm-hmm. For old me deception. <laughs> Fuck you, Spencer. <laughs> <laughs> Himo is an absolute professional. <laughs> he is. You know you've never had a complaint about him. <laughs> no, no. Using inspiration for this, goddamn. <laughs> oh. Change the color of your goddamn numbers. Okay. <laughs> no. Uh, oh no, Mac. Someone... Oh, Mac, no. Oh, no. Macaroni! 
Oh, uh, no. Uh oh, the same he's thing's back. happening. Oh, he's back in the night again. No. No. Yeah, same oh, thing's no. happening as last time. Ripperoni. Oh, Ripperoni, macaroni. Uh, okay. Indeed. Like, that's pretty good. Like, let me let me get away with that. Come on. <laughs> oh, I see. I didn't realize he was a, uh, mm. a troubled employee. No, it's only it's only been once or twice, and we we we've only talked to him like once. I just want to make sure that like it it doesn't become a habit, you know? Because right. he's, I mean, you know, he's he's the best that we've got. So it would be a shame to have to let well, him go. He was very professional with me. He... That's that's wonderful to hear. <clears throat> go on. Do you want me to? You were about to. I just want to know what she was going to say. <laughs> <laughs> no, he treated me, you know, very well. Um, nothing out of the ordinary, at least. That That's I noticed. good. I'm, I'm glad you were satisfied with with your session with him. Mm. Mm-hmm. She'll do a general. She's gonna do Got a general anyone? insight on you. No, leave me alone, Captain. <laughs> so you'd say you'd be coming again? <laughs> <laughs> but um bump. But um bump. Hmm. You know, I uh, I can't say I'll uh, I'll be acquiring his services again. So, she winks at you. She looks, she gets like a little slight, tiny blush. Like, mm -hmm. I, I mean, that's a shame to hear. I like, we hope that you'll still return to the hidden snake. Oh, we have no. Lots I, of other. The place is very, very nice. Very professional. The, the other brothel in that city is too rich for my blood. Mm-hmm. Mm hmm but and honestly like our very... we have the same quality of like exactly yeah, yeah. better prices too mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. i agree mm -hmm. yeah but it's good to know no i just i guess i won't be using him oh again <laughs> <laughs> To hear. Mm. <laughs> I'm kidding. I don't say that. I'm not gonna do that to the captain. I want to be in good terms. <laughs> it was very <sighs> nice talking with you, Captain. Mm. Maybe I'm, I'm gonna go get some rest. Oh, do you need? Do you need something? You and uh, you. What's his name? The Firehead. Um. Kasim. Mm hmm The hooded one and I have Ormac. very little association with them, ma'am. Mm. Ormax or Ormax a, a good friend. Yeah. I'm proud to be associated with Ormac. Yes, he's very useful. Can I incite her? <laughs> Go ahead, yeah. <laughs> oh yes! <laughs> Inspiration! <laughs> Nice. Get her, get her, get her. You yes. saw, you see a bit of a, a a gleam in her eye, like she she gets more interested when she says Aura Max name. Captain, like like I said, I'm very close with Aura Max. If if you like, I could put in a good word for you, or <laughs> see if he's got any spare time, one on one. Captain what you maybe? say is your business. <laughs> but anyway, um... All right. I'm just saying, if you wanted to ask me for a favor, I wouldn't mind. <laughs> what I was going to say is that... Uh, meet me... Meet me by my in my quarters. Um, uh, later tonight. I'd like to... Fill you guys in on a bit of the information. 
But you'll be... Uh, me, Oramak, Kasim, and, and Val, or no? Yes, Ooh. you four. Okay, okay. Mm, okay. No. Do you really need Kasim and Val? Is that, in, is that important? <laughs> you are... You're the four that are on the expedition for... to fulfill King Red Axe's... Um... Uh, Mission, fulfill his mission. So, you are the four that need to hear this. Okay, I will go and inform them immediately. Uh, when when did you want to see us? Tonight. So in a about an hour or so. An hour or so. Yes, ma'am. I will go and inform them. Mm. Uh, this just was a lovely talk. Hmm? Meet, meet me for dinner. Yes. Oh. Should I ask Ormac to prepare anything special for you? <laughs> oh, I think whatever he prepares will be just to my liking. Would be most satisfying, you might say. <laughs> she winks at you. <laughs> this was a lovely <laughs> talk, Captain. <laughs> and then I'm going to walk away. All right. That went so much better than I thought I could do. Way to go! <laughs> I thought she was gonna rip me into an asshole, Dude, man. It's almost like she's a totally reasonable person all the time. And right? only Val and Kasim make her pissed off. Yeah! Constantly. yeah. <laughs> you guys got on her bad oh, side yeah. real quick! <laughs> yeah. It's yeah. almost like she's a completely reasonable yeah. person surrounded by maniacs. Yeah. Mm -hmm. <laughs> Crazy thing, oh. that. Fucking uh, yeah. Sadly, that's not the case, and she's a total bitch all the time. <laughs> all, all the time. time. Mm -hmm. Oh my time. god. <laughs> Alrighty. Oh, cool. I'm a. I'm a. I can go find Oramac first. All right. Did Val ever return to have his conversation with Oramac or no? <laughs> Probably. <laughs> okay. Cool. Cool. Yeah. So you guys uh, are just sitting hanging out. Yeah. Sure. You yeah. find Oramac and Val conversing while uh, Oramac finishes up his uh, preparations for, for dinner. Real quick. Uh, Cass was on the top deck apologizing to Chandra, right? Was uh, yeah. my conversation on the top deck? Because if I saw Kasim yeah, was. on the top deck, I would have informed him first. Okay, then I would have just fucking went over to him first if I saw him. Okay. Q -Q. Well, do your guys' conversation first then. Are you still talking to uh, Chandra? I no, think I just walked. Uh, I just finished. Okay. Yeah. Cool. Hey, uh, Kasim, uh, the captain wants to see us in about an hour. She she wants us to join her for dinner. <laughs> like you see me like go visibly pale. Oh. What? What was wrong? Uh I mean, did you see what just happened a few minutes ago? Yes, she you did. Kind of yelled at you. Yeah. <laughs> yeah. I mean, so I kind of deserved it. So yeah, I know. I... All you have to do is behave. Just and behave. you would think that would come easy, but somehow it eludes me. So okay, here's 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 a trick that my 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 dads like to use with Lance whenever they have uh -huh. company over. Just don't say anything. Unless anyone asks you a direct question. You ask too keep your much. Mouth shut. <laughs> you ask for the impossible. You're saying you're saying my twelve year old brother can do something that you, a grown up, can't Look, do. Look, he is a very talented boy. I don't know what to tell you, Drake. She's making a face <laughs> <at> you. <laughs> He'll just giggle. <laughs> okay, okay, I'm, I'm sorry. I'll I will give it a shot. I will Try not to speak unless spoken to. You you can sometimes be very charming. So just try to try to use that when you're speaking. Okay? I, I believe in you. Aw. Thank you. I'll uh, do my best. Rolling deception. Okay. <laughs> <laughs> No, fucking, I saw a fucking shadow. <laughs> it's just Spence. Yeah. Spence is just rolling shit. I'm not doing God that. Goddamn. Yeah, I'm, I'm just saying things. nice things to you. <laughs> mm -hmm. I, I'm gonna okay, okay. Um, I'm I'm gonna go tell uh, Val and Ormac because she also wants to see them. 
So I'll see you in like an hour. Cool. Uh, thanks for the heads up. The, You're welcome. As you guys are having this conversation as well, the winds oh, no. and the rain start picking up massively. There uh -oh. seems to be a storm brewing. Oh my god. Uh oh. That doesn't seem like it bodes super well. Yeah. Do you think? Well, I mean, I guess whatever happens, we'll deal with it. But what were you gonna? Oh, just saying. Like, I'm I'm no meteorologist, but does is this does it seem like a, a bad things are afoot weather wise? <laughs> what I know. Roll a nature check. Thank you. Roll nature or survival. Ooh, which is higher? Both of you do Survival's this. higher. Okay. Uh, nature. Nature. I'm very good. <laughs> this... I don't know why I asked you. Apparently, I know more about this. <laughs> you know way more than I do. Uh, you think with this, uh, this size of a ship, with the the cr the size of the crew, this type of ship won't capsize it. Um. But it could, uh, you know, it, it wouldn't be very wise to keep sailing normally, for sure. Yikes. <clears throat> yeah. yeah. Yeah, this, I think this is about to get real rough, do you think? I mean, the captain already knows, but, like, just in case? Maybe we should go uh, ask her if she, she needs anything real yeah. quick. Yeah, it seems like it might be a good step in the right direction, get back you in know, her good grace. I was going to say, you know what? You ask her. Because I just had a really good conversation with her, so I think we're, we're on good terms. So you, you ask her. You offer help. Cool. So she doesn't cool. hate you I quite do as that. much. I can, yeah, I, can, yeah. I can try and help. I can do yeah. that. I can be helpful. All right. Cool. I will see you at dinner. Shove him forward. <laughs> <laughs> oh, uh, I'm going to go tell I'll everybody. I'll go uh, run to, to the ca try and find the captain. All right. She is very busy uh, right now, like directing crew members, uh, fixing things herself, like yelling and just over the over the picked up uh, winds and rain. Um, she doesn't notice your arrival. Like she doesn't notice your approach. Uh, Captain Grayscale. Grayscale. Uh, that's the one. <laughs> That's not a yes. good way to get back in a good Christmas. <laughs> oh. so, sorry, ma'am. Um, I just saw the kind of incoming bad weather, and I wanted to see if there was anything I could do to, to help you out and prepare for it. No, we have this under control. Just go down and stay safe. Gotcha. I'll, uh, should I warn everyone else to go down uh, below deck as well if they're not uh, among the crew? No, they'll get the message. Gotcha, gotcha. Mm -hmm. uh, run off. All right. You run off to the lower deck. Uh, those in the lower deck, uh, you guys would definitely be able to hear, like, the rain just pelting the side, uh, the like, the, the walls of the boat. Um, hear wind howling above you. Uh, I know those sounds. Anybody who's seasick, uh, the oh, boat no. is rocking very, you know, it's swaying Ooh. very heavily. Oh, God. 15. Oh, that's okay. You... Keep it together. Keep it together. Yeah, oh, you're, you're fine for now. <laughs> <laughs> okay. Um, should be fine, but just. Yeah, you're good. <laughs> I'm gonna say I think I'm fine, but let's I can find out. You, yeah. you don't need to roll. Not if you don't only want not... to, Drake. Your cool, cool. Your experience can, uh, you know, sort Figured. of wave this. I got you, yeah. boy. Yeah, I got you. Mm -hmm. I was yeah. thinking, Same I was thinking with Ormac. Yeah, like you would, just the case. you wouldn't have needed to roll. <laughs> well, that uh, not sure only sounds like not... the end of that list of people. <laughs> mm -hmm. <laughs> it, How you I'll... feeling, brother man? I'll I'll leave the choice up to you if you think Val would be, you know, seasick. I don't think he would. Okay. I don't think he's not. I don't think he's particularly afraid of the sea or gets motion sick or anything like that. Okay. Yeah. You don't need to roll then. Alright. Alright. So. 
Ormac is not only not seasick, he's singing as he finishes up his the, the cooking. <laughs> no. <laughs> he's singing sea shanties. Oh, the sea shanty. Yeah. You, you get the whole, like, you get everybody who's below deck singing with you. They love they love their sea shanties. fucking walk into this like, what the hell? You got like a, <laughs> you got like a frying <laughs> pan in one hand, and you're like standing with your, like in a wide stance, waiting for the boat to sway so you can flip what's in it with the sway of the boat. <laughs> hell yeah! Everyone certainly yeah. seems to be in high spirits. Yeah, Ormac definitely seems and very used to this. And it's over the mountains and over the seas. <laughs> yeah. Hell yeah. Uh, hey, Ori. Friend Drake! Ori! Hey! <laughs> <laughs> I'm, I'm just gonna, excuse, excuse me. I'm just gonna, yep. No, <laughs> I'm just trying to get through to him. <laughs> yeah, easy enough. Ori. I uh, know, right? <laughs> Ori, hey, um, the captain has asked that me and you and Val and Kasim join her for dinner in about an hour or so. So if you wanna make something special for the captain. I'm sure that would go oh, wonderful. really well. Mm. Mm. All right, I'll, I'll have to throw in something, but uh, hours should be enough time. Uh, hint, hint. Let me, let me finish, let me finish, let me finish serving up what I've got here for the, the rest of the crew, and then I'll, uh, oh yeah, yeah, you, I can put something you got, you got an hour, you're, you're, you're all good. Is Val here? Yeah, yeah I'm probably yeah. somewhere nearby. It's just like camera pans. He's right next to me, like hanging out. Like, hey, <laughs> I, I didn't ask you. I'm like asking fucking <laughs> us out of character. <laughs> Looks at Ori. Um, masked guy. <laughs> I don't think you know his name yet, right? Do you? That I know of. Who? I know, right? I'm trying to keep secrets. Anyway, uh, masked. Guy, uh, the captain wants you to join us for dinner in like an hour. It's hard to I'll it's hard to there. keep track. Mm -hmm. Cool, cool. I've already informed your brother. They also told him to be on his best behavior and only speak when spoken to. You're welcome. We'll see how long that sticks. <laughs> I mean, I told him that my 12 year old brother could do it, so if he couldn't do it, you know. Oh. Mockery has not usually been a thing that Kasim responds particularly well to, but we'll see. I will take note of that. Thank you. It may more be dependent on the messenger. Hmm. We'll see. Well, well, I got an hour to kill. What are you guys doing? <laughs> I'm just gonna chill. <laughs> <laughs> We're singing! <laughs> Ah. Uh, am I? Have I made my way over to you guys? Or... Probably. Sure. Cool. It's like, you know what? I need to take my mind off of all of this swaying. Val, you bring your, uh, your loot? Let me see if I did. Ooh. Now Ori knows his I name. I did bring yeah. my loot. Do you want to... Excellent. Now you, you know that his name is Val. <laughs> friend, friend, oh, you now, you, oh. now you can stop hmm? calling him Masked One. I can. That's a lovely name, Val. Thank Smiling you. at you. <laughs> it's a wonderful name. It's a shame we can't see the beautiful face that I'm sure goes with your beautiful Yes, name. I'm sure it is quite the shame. But yes, I did bring my loot. Why did you want it? No, I, I have my own, dear brother. I was wondering if you wanted to have a good old duet. Play some music for these fine people. You play the lute? My huh. parents made us take lessons together. They were hoping to make us mm. stop fighting for two seconds. I forgot that a I, lute huh? was an instrument, and I was like, why Why would you bring out like a bag of gold? What does that do <laughs> yeah. in the situation? Yeah, right? <laughs> oh my god. Yeah. <laughs> Did you Would bring you like to loot? play the illicit goods? Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> Oof. That doesn't make any sense. <laughs> oh, I dare not upstage Krusk. Maybe he can join us. We can we can harmonize. Come on, it'll be fun. Pass the time. It's not we're all stuck down here anyway. 
If it might pacify you for upwards of an hour, then sure, I will play the loot. <laughs> if you do this for me, I promise I'll be so, so Ormac good. Starts serving out for the rest Heck of the crew. Yeah. What do we have in Ori? Uh, I'm working on something special for the dinner up later, but for the rest of the crew, I'm finishing up that stir fry I was talking about earlier. Heck yeah. Oh, something very yeah. different. Yeah. <laughs> for the four of us, stir fry. For the captain, duck au gratin. <laughs> <laughs> Yo, yeah! It's fancy as shit. Oh my god. Fucking... The souffle for am, dessert. Mr. <laughs> <laughs> Mr. Krusk, sir. Yes, yes, what is it? Do you by any chance know any songs with uh, three loot parts? Perhaps some sort of harmony. Do I know any? Uh, of course I do. Uh, Heck yeah, lay it on me, sir. Uh, well, okay, I'll just get on my th my three loots, I guess. Um... <laughs> no, no, I, I, no, no, that would be a bit too much to ask, I think. Me and my brother can back you up. What? He's already, like, got them out. He, like, snapped his fingers and they're playing by themselves. What? How are you... I mean, that's impressive. Maybe five loot parts? I don't have that many loots. Yeah, very impressive. I mean, I'm saying we do. We have loots. You have loots? Why did you bring loots? I don't know. We have loots. We know how to play loots. Well, that's cool. Stop saying loots. <laughs> Can we play our loots with your loots? Uh, sure. Heck yeah, let's play some loots. I don't know any songs with five-part loots, though. Well, we can just... We'll, we'll make do with the three. Come on, Val! But what what would you be doing? I've got the three loots. Just put two of your loots away, and we'll use two of our loots. And we'll, it'll be like a bonding thing. We'll have some <laughs> that fun. That doesn't make any sense. Uh, he snaps his fingers, they drop like from air. Watching. <laughs> <laughs> he snaps his fingers, they just drop midair. Just boom. <laughs> hmm. Hmm. I probably should have put, like, a pillow under those before I did that. Oh, well. Yeah, those are going to get damaged. Yeah, well. So, uh, all right. Uh, hands you, like, sheet music. Uh, do you know you know how to play these? These right here? Yeah. yeah, this looks familiar. I think I got it. All right, follow my lead. Under three, two, one! Uh, <laughs> and you play a ditty. Wow. Dragon forces through the fire and the flames. Yeah. <laughs> Hell yeah! Every time! <laughs> Fuck yeah, dude. dude fucking Bond Cross could play it. <laughs> oh. Crash. I was going to say, out of the three of them, who plays the loot the best? Probably Cross, oh, right? Oh, fucking Jesus, if he doesn't beat us. <laughs> mm -hmm. roll, yes, roll, need roll, roll performance checks. Uh, well, All right. Roll performance. Mm -hmm. uh, you get to add your proficiency bonus if you're proficient in the okay. instrument. I'm going to just do one of these. Yeah, maybe he's just better with a mandolin. Let me see here. That is fucking. Sorry, one sec. It's being a butt. Ah, oh, jeez. Just add a plus two in your modifier and roll a uh, roll performance. Yeah. Unless you're already proficient in performance. Uh, I'm actually not. Okay. Uh, oh. can, I, can I use inspiration? Sure. Cool. Okay. You and Val are comparable to each other. Mm. Uh, you guys are using your... Sense. Yeah, you guys are using your beginning uh, loot classes to, uh, to your advantage. Um, whereas Crust rolled a 25. <laughs> Holy shit! <laughs> hey, man, if we added both R's together, we'd have beat him by one. It's true. It's true. <laughs> like his backup. Yeah, pretty much. He He's gets the her. lead part of this. Mm -hmm. Krusk just like slowly yet subtly lifts the lutes back up and <laughs> tries to play louder yeah. than us. Oh. <laughs> oh. Ouch. He is. Not a competition, Mr. Krusk. Oh. Oh, but it is. <laughs> and he. Is it? Uh, I want to, I'm going to go to my bunk and I'm going to get my violin and come play. Oh, oh yeah. yeah. You also play an instrument. Oh, that's wonderful. He snaps his finger. A violin floats out of his bag. No. 
<laughs> oh, well, all right, and here we go. <laughs> Roll a or a Mac check. not at all getting what's going on yeah. starts playing the spoons. Nice. <laughs> Hell yeah. Oh my god. I love it. Inspiration! <laughs> Wait, I'm also <laughs> proficient. <laughs> Spoon man! <laughs> A spoon man. <gasps> <gasps> radio plan. All right. Okay, that's pretty good. I do pretty good. <laughs> yeah. yeah. Can Krusk beat a mm -hmm. twenty-two like he already did? Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> Let's see what happens. Yes. <laughs> Damn it! <laughs> yes, he What'd did. He get? Got a twenty-four. Damn. Whatever, we jamming. It's a good time. Yeah, yeah we're jamming. <laughs> you get the whole crew like super excited. It turns into a fucking concert here. Like, <laughs> hell yeah. Uh, or it's just like banging on pots and pans. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> like, like, <laughs> eventually, I'm I'm attributing the I'm attributing the seven to the fact that he's still cooking and not really like, yeah <laughs> seeing it as a competition. He's not at all getting the vibe you guys are going Hell for. Yeah. He's just like yeah. But... The spoons you're playing are the same ones that you've used to cook with, so they still got stuff on them <laughs> and they kind of stick and it makes the tempo go a little off. Oh no! Ah, uh, gross. <laughs> yeah, you guys are oh. playing. For a little bit. <laughs> Eventually you see uh you see Captain Grey Sail come down as you guys are playing. Uh she she watches you guys for a little while. Very she seems entertained. Like she's got a <laughs> sort of leaning up against one of the uh one of the walls and sort of bobbing her head, tapping her foot to it. Um, she's just like, oh shit, is this fucking Seven lutes, two violins with spoons accompaniment. The the song. <laughs> Let me get my spoons. Uh, oh, uh, Kasim, roll yes, me, yes, no. oh, roll shit. me Arcana. Ooh, okay. I thought I was think. Oh, sorry. Spencer? What? Can he? Inspiration? Oh, sure. Cool. I'm gonna do that. Yeah. Get him. 15. Get him, get him, get him. Okay. From that, you you know, you notice that um Krusk is very magically talented uh with his uh with his bardic abilities at least. More so than you think he should be, probably. Huh. What we're playing like five musical instruments simultaneously. Yeah, like <laughs> some of that were was bit, but <laughs> was a bit. <laughs> but, <laughs> um, but sure. <laughs> but yeah, he is. Uh, it's a little, it's a little odd. Like you've never seen any any bards, uh, that were this magically talented, but. You don't think it's any, like, malicious or anything? Hmm. Just something you notice. Interesting. Gotcha, gotcha. All right. <clears throat> Still playing, or is the concert over? Uh, eventually the song does end. You get a very large uh, cheer from the crowd. Um, <laughs> and dinner is served. Um... Are we supposed to have it in the captain's quarter? Yes. Or is that for everyone uh, else? Okay. Uh, you know, serving for everyone else and then yeah. spending the hour to uh, finish up something uh, special for us and the captain. Mm -hmm. Cool. Yeah. Captain uh, goes to her quarters. She gives you gives you all a look, uh, nods slightly, and then uh, goes to her quarters. I'm also I'm also Look taking I'm else. taking Chase's joke and I am indeed like not like not just for the captain but the four of us are going to have a very nice uh roast duck uh uh <gasps> oh, oh, hell yeah. delightful 
<laughs> I just, I'm just imagining because like our our storeroom is like dry. Uh, so it's just like, all right, yeah, we're gonna have dinner with the captain. You're like, the captain? I'll need something special. And you just grab like a harpoon with a chain on it and go above <laughs> deck and just like, ah! <laughs> and just, just pulls in a fucking dolphin or some shit. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> uh, I dig it. Uh, okay. Time. You're just gonna look to everyone else then. Go to the captain's quarters. Yeah. <clears throat> All right. You head over to the captain's quarters. You knock on her door. Um, she opens the door. Exactly. Uh, she She's not exactly like, you know, in her, you know, pajamas, but she is dressed down from her uh, usual wear. Like hat and coat off. Yeah. And, yeah. 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 She's gotten more comfortable, at least. Um, yeah. Hell yeah! Come in, and she she gestures to a uh, a round table with some tables uh, with some uh, with some seats set for you all. Oh. Take a seat. All right. Yeah. Same. All right. I'm gonna make sure that Ori sits next to the captain. Guys, mm. yeah, <laughs> just... wait a minute. He's about to like take a seat then that's me, like next then to Val, Val then or Kim. something. <laughs> it's like, nope, mm-hmm. get right in, yeah. right under him. You know, I'm like, oh no, I'd, I'd like to sit next to Val. You, you sit next to the captain. Oh, sure thing, friend Drake. Just <laughs> shift to the other side of the table. Oh, would you? Mm-hmm. Mm-hmm. Is there any particular <laughs> reason you're trying to sit next to me? <laughs> oh, <I'm on> <laughs> Do I? With an 18, do I read shipper energy? I'm going to wink at that. <laughs> That's <laughs> not that. up to me. <laughs> That's up From to whom? That. From yeah, Ori from and the captain or from Drake I'm, re- and I'm trying to read uh, Drake and why she's doing that. Am I, am I reading shipper energy there? I'm very much just trying to get Ori to sit next to the captain because I'm shipping them. But because Val is sus of me, I'm going with that energy. So on both sides, yeah, probably. <laughs> Raise my own eyebrow, you, like interesting. You okay. read it's either like it's like oh he's trying to she's trying to get to my brother. Mm-hmm. <laughs> mm-hmm. I did just wink at him, so like yeah. a lot of winking. Mm-hmm. Mm-hmm. So much winking. Mm-hmm. All right, <laughs> wink girl, man. <laughs> <laughs> All right. <sighs> what a this is a very lovely meal that you prepared, uh, Oramac. Thank you for saying so, Captain. I'm smiling proudly at him. I uh, I thought I'd make something special for the occasion. As, uh, <laughs> you don't you don't typically invite uh, crew members into your quarters. Yes, I um, yeah, not not incredibly often. Sometimes we'll. If I feel like playing a game of cards or something, I'll invite some of the crew. Uh, it doesn't happen extremely often, though. I do like my private space. But, um... Probably wondering why I asked you here. Well, the thought had crossed my mind. <laughs> I just wanted to inform you in some of the... Some of the details. Of what I know, at least. I've grown to be uh, fond of a couple of you, and I don't particularly want you to die. Or... My eyes go to Oromac and then right to her. <laughs> Aw, she doesn't want him to die. It's cute. That's so nice. That's so romantic. <laughs> yeah. yeah. Get her. Get her. <laughs> I'm so, Get away. I'm so glad that the four of us have made such an impression on you. <laughs> She's yeah, you sure have. But, uh... Any, uh would you be interested in learning a, at least a little bit about where you're going? Please. <laughs> That'd be wonderful. Yes, that would be lovely. Well, like you already know, uh, you are heading to Gundarlin. A uh, 
Gandarlin is ruled by King Red Axe, uh, but is divided into 15 holds, each ruled by a Jarl who owe fealty to the king. Apparently, one of the Jarls of Gundarlin complained to the king that a strange vessel crashed a mile or two away from his hold. A, um... Give me a sec. Yeah. Supposedly, some strange folk emerged from the wreck and killed a few peasants who came over to see what the disturbance was, hence... The need for a military presence. Mm. Uh, unfortunately, the the king has been preoccupied with dealing with pirates and and the Sohuigan. But that's that's why he uh, sent Store the messenger to Lord Neverember to request help from adventurers such as yourselves. I see. Nodding and understanding. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. Yes. And that led to me. Lord of Ember hired, uh, hired me through the White Sails Company uh, to take you essentially take you to the king himself. Interesting. Hmm. Hmm. Lord, so uh, that's who we'll be meeting up with when we make landfall? You will most likely be meeting with king, the king himself, yes. Understood. Mm -hmm. Lord Neverember doesn't pay much, uh, doesn't have much time for King Redax, viewing him as a minor lord who can't really do m much to truly help the Lord's Alliance. Thus, the less direct uh, approach in helping him. Mm. Mm. But, yes. <sighs> Let's, uh, Majority of the of the information I had for you, at least. Do you not know any more about these so-called attackers? Uh, whether they are phantoms, uh, hum other humans who simply survived the wreck, driven mad, creatures of the night. I've heard rumors of strange creatures, but nothing past that. Hmm. I don't know. Hmm much about Gundarlin itself. I'm from Mintarn myself, but yeah, that's pretty mm. much all I know. Hm. Hopefully mm. this information will prove useful at least a little bit to you all. That's very useful, Captain. Thank you. Indeed. I'm glad. Now, uh, let's eat this delicious meal that the wonderful Ormac has prepared for us. Hmm? Hmm. I, uh... It does look delicious, Ori. You've outdone yourself. I agree. Thank you. I was, I was worried that I wouldn't have quite enough time to get the gravy right, uh, but I, th I think I managed. <laughs> I think you can put... You can do anything you put your mind to, Ori. May I call you Ori? By all means. Perfect. Now. <laughs> right? I'm so happy. <laughs> <laughs> now. Let's, uh... Let us eat. Uh, I wish to hear of some of your exploits. Um, all of yours. Val was telling me some very interesting tales of his past earlier today. Val, would you want to share some interesting stories from your past with our captain? Mm, such as? Which one happened to strike your fancy? Uh, the, the one about why you wear the mask. Mm. Did I go into detail on that? Well then. I... 
I'll I'll take the the lower part of my mask down, like the the black cloth part down, so that I can mm. eat while we're sure. talking. Mm. Uh, and uh, I'll say, yes, it's not exclusively for aesthetic. It's a tactical choice, one that I've developed while sparring with opponents back home. If they can't see where I'm looking, if they can't tell what facial expression I'm making, if they can't read me, then their defenses are lower and they don't know what to expect. They're, they're not as quick to make a certain move, or I can at least lead them towards one. Uh, it helps in social situations as well as combat situations. I see. Hmm. Interesting. Isn't it? Indeed. Indeed. Well, how about you, Drake? Oh, me and the captain have already had a very good conversation. It's about what I do, where I'm from. She already knows. Mm. Not very That's... interesting. Any interesting stories, Drake? Well, perhaps the captain doesn't know very much about your brother who stood upon his ship. Would you care to enlighten yes, us? The Some things about him? First mate. I've, I've already apologized profusely to the captain. <laughs> Because of Lance, I'm I'm sorry again, Captain. It's fine. Mm. He's uh, provided some entertainment, at least. Well, it turns out he's yes, a pretty and a pretty good be... card player. Hmm. Interesting. The crew seem to be very willing to go along with whatever he says. <laughs> <laughs> she looks so fucking bitter. <laughs> like, she's so hard to suppress a smile. <laughs> mm -hmm. Oh, sure, but that's all things that we already know. Why not go into more detail? What What would you like to know, Captain? Like, purposefully looking away from <laughs> Val asking the Captain. <laughs> Back when we were, uh, when we were fighting those pirates... You seem to have a personal relationship with that, uh, uh, the captain of their ship, Captain Callus. Mm. What's the story there? Well, he, he attacked the town that, that I live in. Um, attacked Neverwinter. Did he? I'm trying to remember. I'm looking at my notes right now. You live in Neverwinter. <laughs> I'm double checking. Yep. Yeah. <laughs> cool. Yeah. All I have is the dogs, so I'm assuming. Yeah. That was very bold of so, him. Yeah, he. Yeah, him and that female ogre with the anchor, they just started attacking a bunch of people down at the docks. And Lance, being Lance, was of course there. And Captain Callus was going to hurt him. So I. I jumped in to help him, and he he gave me the scar. Hmm. Interesting. Oh, so you're from Neverwinter. Yes, I'm from Neverwinter. Ah. And it's safe to say, then, that your family has also been working out of Neverwinter. Yeah. <laughs> Looking at you now, so mad about Captain, this. Captain, you tend to frequent Neverwinter every once in a while. How many brothels are there in the city? Uh, sorry, who are you asking that? The captain. captain. Oh. Uh, there are two from what I remember. I see. So it's more, more or less a coin toss as to which one your family operates, Drake. Mm-hmm. Uh, her parents own the hidden snake. Oh. Uh. Oramac? Oramac. <laughs> like at that part, could I break a little bit when you hear hidden snake? I <laughs> 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 just like cover it up with like bites of food, take a drink or something. Like I'm not I'm trying so hard not to make a scene. <laughs> oh, the hidden snake. Mm. Yes, I, I seem to recall quite a few members of our current expedition happening to go around there the night before we left. Mm -hmm. It's just true. <laughs> Good establishment. I oh, have a very long history I hear, Fat Snake. <laughs> <laughs> Fucking is he? <laughs> God 
damn it. Sorry. Okay, I'm furious. Here I go, being furious. <laughs> <laughs> oh, do you frequent there, Aurora Mac? Oh, I've uh, I've stopped by once or twice. <laughs> uh, that's fair. Well, I here I am, having never gone in there. Would you mind telling me about it? I'm glaring at Ormac. <laughs> like, don't, don't, don't. <laughs> Let me see something. <laughs> no! Oh. oh no! I knew you would be my death, Mac. <laughs> this makes sense. <laughs> I love Ormac. <laughs> so much. Oh my god. <laughs> Um, I was, uh, of the, of the two brothels, I mean, basically the same quality, but, oh, the price. Hey. Hey. Hmm? Hey. Higher quality, I think. Have you been to the other? I, I didn't realize you'd ever frequented the competition. Do you frequent your parents' business? No. Well, then how would you know the quality? Yeah, what, what are you comparing it with? I've heard rumors. Cass, didn't we agree that you were going to speak when spoken to? <laughs> <laughs> Put my head back down. Mm -hmm. I, I listen to chatter. I hear what people say. Apparently there's no comparison. Interesting. And yes, our Mac is right. Our prices are far better. <clears throat> So, I assume that you're ready to run the competition out of town, so to speak. If you have higher quality <laughs> products, so to speak, and the prices are so much better. Are, are you proud of your parents' business? Mm -hmm. It seems like you take quite an interest in it. I'm very proud of my parents' business, yeah. I see. But you wouldn't say that you contribute to it in any way. I don't contribute to their business, no. Mm -hmm. well, have you not told Val what you do? You know, she hasn't. I'm trying to tell Val as little as possible, Oromac. I would like it if you would join me in that endeavor. <laughs> oh, oh, is this, uh, is this a game the two of you are playing? Yes. Ah. Yes, it's a game. Mm -hmm. Ah, I see. But no, she well, has yet to tell me what she does. Hmm. Very interesting. I agree. I want to say accountant. You got it. Right on the head, Cass. <laughs> Thought what? I might. <laughs> mm-hmm. Go back to my food. Just enjoy all of it. <laughs> well, it's not fair to play the game if you're gonna lie about it, Drake. Ori, <laughs> my God, the man's right, Drake. Fine. Since you apparently can't read sarcasm, I am in fact not an accountant. What? Why are we all focusing on me <laughs> right well, you now? You need such an interesting well, I feel life. Like... You don't let people in, Drake coming from you. Oh, I didn't say I wasn't being hypocritical. Hmm. Perhaps you can help break down each other's walls. What about speak when spoken to, Cassie? Mm. <laughs> 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 frankly, I think Cassie makes, Ooh, frankly, I think Cassie makes a really good point. <laughs> uh, Captain's just looking at all of us like, what the fuck? Dude, <laughs> she's, she's got to like boots up on the table and like just watching this, like, <laughs> with a smile on her face, like, no, go, keep going. This is fun. <laughs> <laughs> uh, I'm learning so much. Shit. This bitch, though. <laughs> <laughs> that bitch. Man. She is that bitch. <laughs> She's 100% that oh, bitch. Oh, absolutely. Mm-hmm. Uh huh. She's so good. Uh, it's true. Anyway, what were we talking about? Oh yeah, I was trying to change the subject. <laughs> I feel like we have far more interesting things to talk about than my boring life. 
on the subject of Lance, I would like to say that uh, he does somewhat remind me of my first time on a ship and thought perhaps I could uh, teach him some uh, tricks about cooking or, or perhaps on fixing up the ship. I wasn't sure if he had any tools, but I don't know. Perhaps give him a little bit more labor. Ori, that would be wonderful if people were teaching him good, useful things. Looking at fucking Valentine's. I mean, I'd argue that teaching him to cook and repairing a ship are useful skills. Mm Mm-hmm, definitely. I think it should be fine to encourage him to learn, learn things that he's interested in. Whatever they may be. He does keep saying that he'd like to be a pirate, and I'd like to squash that. If anyone would help me, that would be nice. Mm. Just don't encourage it. Thank That's you. interesting. I might be able to help you with that. Thank I, you. I was hypothetically, I might I get that. in return for such a deed? You don't have to do it. I would just appreciate it. My God. <laughs> you can just That's do fine. people favors, brother. <laughs> well, a favor implies that it'll be repaid at some point. What would you like? Mm. Yeah, what would you like? Let's just say... <laughs> let's want? just say... <laughs> <laughs> She's like looking at you two and just like... <laughs> Val, you have a high Val. level passive, for, passive insight. She's, she's got this look on her face that just says, like, y'all are hot. <laughs> Hell yeah! Val, like, audibly falters a little when he goes to go and he's like, let's just... What? <laughs> let's just say <laughs> Let's just say that uh, you'll owe me one. How about that? All right. All right. I'm gonna I'll let you know at which point I intend to rep- reclaim the favor. I look forward to it. All right. <laughs> Very good food by the way, Oramac. It's delicious. Sorry. Outstanding work. Kasim? Yes. <laughs> <laughs> I just said the food's good. <laughs> Kasim, as you seem unable to control yourself, would you have anything to say, thus being directly spoken to when allowing you to speak? Y'all are cute. Oh, Kasim, I shouldn't have trusted you. Thank you for giving me this opportunity. I Thank you, Kasim. I appreciate the compliment. I give the captain a look like. Like pointing like to Drake and Valak, right? And she gives a slight nod. <laughs> <laughs> I give her a nod, like, yeah, you get it. <laughs> the fucking thing Smirking I was imagining like in my head. It's cause seems like looks over to the captain, like nodding his head, like pointing at him, like, yeah, it's them. The captain just looks back at him like fucking how dare you fucking speak to me? <laughs> <She's> like, oh, <laughs> yeah. Just, wait, no, yeah, I forgot. <laughs> Uh. When spoken to, Kasim. <laughs> Do you believe I'm getting the vapors? <laughs> You're right. Damn. So, Oramac, where did you learn to cook something as robust as this? Well, uh, some years ago, I. I'll. Much like Lance, I snuck aboard a ship, and uh, during my time there, I, I learned many a skill on the seas, uh, sailing uh, with a uh, Captain Adrex Noriox. Adrex? Oh. I know yeah. him. Really? I do. Uh, we've crossed paths a couple times. He's very charismatic. I... Lovingly put it. <laughs> There's a a hard worker with a big heart. <laughs> yes, he is. Very eccentric, but <laughs> entertaining. Eccentric in what way? Well, well, <laughs> either of you. Hmm. Gesture uh... to you. <laughs> 
I mean, if this is any indication of his person, we sailed a, a single voyage together, and we apparently bonded so much that he gave me a plot of land. Is that so? Oh, I have yet to see it, though. It's, uh... On shores, I am hesitant to cross. Mm. Which where shores are those? Uh, yeah, where, the, where might that be? Well, the parchment says it's within the city of Moran. Ah. I, mm. uh, <laughs> oh, the city of Moran. Okay. But what? What do you know about the city of Moran? It's interesting. Um, it's known as the Sailor City. Uh, it's the uh, it's in located in the country of Am, A M N. Um, mm. it's the second largest city in in that country. And uh, <laughs> it's it's occupied by mostly merchants, shipwrights. And the Arbor Guard who defend the port. Uh, who. Against pirates and the Thieves' Guild. Uh, their Thieves' Guild, at least. But, uh. That seems like the kind of place that. that he would own a plot of land in. Well, I. I hope. I hope it could be a good home one day, but, uh, there are, there are some unpleasant waters that I, uh, I will need to sail past if I am ever to claim it. Hmm. Yes, uh, yes. I've heard recently that the um and the places around the Nalantha are fairly difficult to traverse at the moment. Well, with all the pirates and whatnot. Yes. Speaking of uh, pirates, I know you all are very or proved your strength in the last encounter with them, but in the future, I'd like to more focus on escaping their clutches than uh, fighting them directly. It's understandable. I can't risk any of my crew members being hmm, killed or anything of the like. Of course. I suppose we'll try our best. Hmm. Do you <laughs> think our ship is faster than others we might run into? Uh, yeah, it can be. And depending on how how I navigate the ship. And with your help, we could uh, could be very useful. Understood. Hmm. I'll try to take that route from now on. Very much appreciate it. I like to keep everything ship shape, uh, if you will. Hmm. <laughs> <Yeah>. <laughs> so. No. <laughs> <laughs> but I appreciate your cooperation indeed <laughs> we'll do our best good um, I don't uh, I don't typically run from fights but I uh <laughs> I, I see no reason to start conflicts when we need none hmm. and you're fighting by your Fighting by yourself is almost easier sometimes. It's when you have to look mm. out for others that things can get a little hectic. Yes. Mm. But, as you are very well aware, Drake. Mm-hmm. <sighs> anyway... Uh, were you about to ask something, Chase? Uh, I kind of was, but I think I remembered the thing I was going to ask. I was going to ask how Quora got on the ship, but I'm pretty sure he just, like, paid to be there. Hmm. Yeah, he's part of the expedition. Yeah. Essentially. 
Yeah, I remember he wasn't there yeah, for the same just... reasons we were, but yeah, no. he's still going to the same spot. Mm hmm Yeah. He is. Cool. Cool. I uh, am good. All right. You all uh, finish your dinner, unless you have anything else to talk to the captain about. I, f I feel like at some points, Ormek would just be like, it seem I am talking to you. What would you like to say? <laughs> yeah. Oh, what a boy! <laughs> oh, that's very nice. Your, your food is quite delicious. I'm impressed you were able to make something so fancy with such limited ingredients. That's, uh, a little goes a long way. That's uh, something I learned very quickly working uh, working with uh, Captain uh, Adrix. <laughs> well done, Mr. Must have learned a lot on that uh, ship. <laughs> more, more than I learned in many lifetimes, I imagine. Hmm. Ever think about getting your own ship? You look damn hmm. spiffy in a captain hat. He's not wrong, Ari. Hmm. I have. Thoughts occurred once or twice, as I've said. I uh, I own land elsewhere, and it's occurred to me how it'd be interesting to at least see this land I apparently own, but uh, I've not I've not exactly had the um, means to purchase as such. Yeah, out of character. Is this place like an island somewhere? I'm trying to see if it's on like the map. Yeah, it's in like the Nalanther Isles area, right? Yeah, it's in the. Oh wait, wait, which which area are you talking about? Um or Am? Moran? Like the. It's not an island. Yeah, the. The uh. Oh, okay. The yeah Moran, which is within Am, um, was yes. it? Yeah. A M N Am. Um. Yeah, um, not an island yeah. to itself, but it does have a very <laughs> difficult to traverse mountain range. Oh, I think I found it. Okay. Yeah. Oh, I Shoot. spelled that totally wrong. Uh, oh, shit. Southeast of a map. Mm -hmm. oh. yeah. yeah. Try not to look at the map too much, since you guys wouldn't have access to one right now. Oh, okay. Hey, yeah. Yeah. But, yeah. Um... Gotcha. <sighs> you guys, uh, you guys finish up your meal. Um, uh, Gray Sail escorts you out. Um, and, uh, you guys can, uh, <laughs> uh, sleep for the night. Yeah. I, I just wanted to add on another comment Ormac would have made in the conversation of just, mm -hmm. oh, sure. You know, I, uh, I've always seen myself uh, sort of either on my own or supporting others. I don't, I don't typically picture myself as the captain of any ship. Hmm. Gotcha. Yeah, nothing wrong with that. <laughs> Definitely leaves you more free to move where the wind takes you. Hmm. Indeed. Now we move on. A toast to good foods and better friends. <laughs> yeah. <toast>. Yeah. <laughs> All right. I feel like Oramac's going to be the fucking glue that holds y'all together. Oh, yeah. <laughs> oh, <laughs> fuck. We don't slit each other's throats. If he's not the glue, yep. it will be the vice grip that holds us yeah. together. <laughs> <laughs> okay, but, like, is that, like... Is that like the Agent Coulson of of this team? <laughs> oh, <goodness. laughs> oh no! Cause oh dear! <laughs> oh no! <laughs> well, let's be real here. You got the most hit points out of anyone. If anyone's gonna die, you're like last on that list. <laughs> oh yeah, True. you're fine. <laughs> yeah, maybe, but I'm also the I'm also the one that's always in like front of the line. Mm-hmm. Because that's how he. I mean, that, Jack lived. That's, that's so. how he do. Yeah. Uh, all right. So, mm -hmm. you guys. Nice uh, up for the night. Yeah, sleep for the night. 
Now, uh, I'd like to offer you guys just a, uh, like a couple days pass sort of deal. Like, okay. Cool. Unless you guys also, want to do can anything. Long rest us so that I get my spell back. <laughs> 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 Fucking sure. <laughs> Thank you. <laughs> like, <laughs> yeah, I got this. Woo! Appreciate your uh, your hit your temp hit points. Oh, are my gone. temp went away, so I'm so, gonna just yeah, just I'm gonna, add I'm gonna eight. do my thing. Real quick. Yeah. <laughs> just just add eight. Yeah, cause I'm gonna do it on max anyway. <laughs> <laughs> there it is. <laughs> okay. What does she do every morning? <laughs> All right. I will. Uh, one interaction I would like to do actually before. Uh, oh boy. The days pass. Uh oh. Drake. Oh. Leave me alone. Get her. Get her, Spencer. You hear a voice in your head. Yeah, man. Oh no! A familiar voice. Shit. I've, I've been able to avoid this for this long. <laughs> <laughs> been been doing so well. You hear your uh, you hear Connor's voice in your head. Oh, Say it wasn't what I thought it was. Oh shit. Okay, cool. Oh no, no, not that one. <laughs> yeah, I was like, oh no. <laughs> cool. You hear Connor's voice in your head though. Your father. <laughs> ha. Hi, Say, Dad. uh, this is a sending message, so this is okay. Gonna be, yeah. Drake, I heard from Lance that you took him onto the ship that you were going into, uh, that you were boarding. Is this true? I, can I respond? You can respond in 25 this... words. 25 words. Okay. Uh, <clears throat> he's lying. He stowed away. Don't worry. We're taking good care of him. I'll bring him back safe. I don't know how many that was. <laughs> okay. I lost count. I love you. End, but it was like less than 20. <laughs> I love you. Yeah. Cool. <laughs> I, I love you. <laughs> She's at the end. <laughs> uh. I love it. Mm -hmm. All right. Uh, cool. That's their day. That's that day. Good. <laughs> Thank God. Uh, oh, okay. <laughs> they can only afford so many sending spells. I know. Uh. So. I feel like I handled that well. <laughs> he like we'll sends see. an insight check. <laughs> yeah. Uh -oh. <laughs> Fucking, I always like the idea that sending gives you twenty five words, like no matter what, and anything else that you say for the rest of the time just gets counted into the twenty five. Mm -hmm. like, he's lying. I stowed. He stowed away. Don't worry. We'll take care of him. I love you. Whew. Okay, I think I nailed that. <laughs> No, I think I. <laughs> Dude, it fucking happens on Critical Role all the time. Fucking, it's uh... like, do you want to say anything else, Laura? And she's just like, do, 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 do. <laughs> like, the end of her fucking message. Oh, so cute. God. So cute, man. Uh, anyway, uh, yeah. November 3rd comes along, and mm. picking Ooh. that is. Fucking wait, yeah, that's that's Oromac's birthday. Oh! Uh, uh, oh! Oh! Happy birthday! Our birthday is still pains. Yeah. <laughs> uh, Happy there's birthday, a big man. Uh, do you let people do you let people know that it is your birthday, Oromac? I feel like Oromac would. Oromac, okay. In that case, um, there uh, the the crew throws a bit of a party for their mm. uh, for their chef. <gasps> oh. Um, oh. 
Yeah, there's a nice uh, party. There's not a lot of gift giving because they're on a boat. They can't really get you anything. Uh, but mm -hmm. there's a there's a party with a lot of uh, a lot of music, a lot of uh, cheer, a lot of drinking as well. And they dip into their oh, yeah. alcohol storage for the for the party. We drink all the rum that we got from the sea. Yeah, <laughs> all the sea rum. All that sea <laughs> rum. Delicious right. serum. Mm. I will wish Oramak a happy birthday and I will a smooch him on the cheek. No. Oh. Get it, boy. Ship! Amazing. Oh, no. <laughs> it's a ship! <laughs> <laughs> oh my god! <laughs> Fucking sharks in the water. <laughs> Waiting for <laughs> that. Oh, shit. <laughs> I'll offer to tell his future if he wants it. Oh. I, I would love that, Kasim. Watch him. Oh, yeah. All right. So what do we got here? Start laying out the cards just ritualistically, making a big production of it. Okay. Getting dancing lights out there, having like floating baubles in the air. Fucking yeah. Ominous wind. Heck yeah. Oh, death card. Uh, and then I swear to death God. Death card and oh, the death card. <laughs> Uh, there there should only be one in here. Is it a deck or is it just a series of death cards? <laughs> <laughs> I swear I'm not doing this on purpose. I think we're just in for a real bad time. Oh, 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 this one, this one I got a good feeling about. It feels different. Oh, the devil. Uh, okay. uh, ah. <laughs> mm. I'll, uh, while I'm passing up, putting up, down these cards, like, is there uh, anything uh, you want to inquire uh, reach out into the universe to get more information about perhaps your anything particular in your future, Ori. Um. I. Will I ever know my father? Oh. Oh. Let's see here. First one I flip up is the moon card in reverse. Hmm. Represents confusion, fear, and I think perhaps most relevantly, misinterpretation. I think there may come a point when you think you know, but you may be being led astray. Turn up another one. The fool. Hmm. Okay, I mean, that definitely does sound like you. Um, re represents, Damn. uh, it's nothing bad. Yeah. <laughs> the name I is feel like you need to clarify right? that. I'm about to. Mm -hmm. <laughs> <laughs> I'm about to, never, never fear. It's nothing bad. It represents the start of the journey. It's the first card in the arcana. It represents uh, innocence, new beginnings, uh, being free of fear and expectations of failure. So I think I think you're you're about to run into a stretch of optimism as you start on this this new journey. And I'll flip up another card, a third card. The magician. Interesting. Okay, represents willpower, desire, and manifestation. I think that if finding your father and knowing him is truly what you desire, it's going to, it's going to test you. It's going to, it'll be possible, but it will come down to your strength of will, how much you are willing to put into it, how much you are willing to lose. But from what I'm seeing, it does seem like if that's what you truly desire, it is in the cards for you. Hmm. And that's it. Looking back and forth between them. Mm. Or a Mac hugs him. <laughs> Thank you, friend. Oh. He... <gasps> oh. No problem, big guy. I, I hope you find him. If there's, if there's anything you, if you ever need any guidance or just help in hand, just let me know. Will do. Did you just make a friend? 
<laughs> Are you asking in character? Yeah. I mean, maybe. I've been known mm. to do it from time to time. <laughs> <laughs> Alright. Kasim, you're not just you're not just making shit up, are you? <laughs> Better not be. I whispered that, you butt up. <laughs> I'm like right no, next to y'all's faces. I'm like, oh okay, I'll get out of here. I'm just kidding. <laughs> the car I The cards Go are up on. to interpretation, brother. I I I see what I see, and I just hope that I've read them correctly. That sounds a bit like a cop-out. Look, it's not an exact science, or even a science. <laughs> but I, I do what I can, and... I don't know, I'm, I'm optimistic. I, 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 I take this as a good sign. All right, then. I mean, look... Look at him, man. He, he's, he's so happy. Like, he, he has hope. Like, I, I don't know exactly what this means to him, but I think it means a lot that he thinks his dad is out there. That he might get to know him. Okay. I'm not the one who tries to tell the future, Kasim. So if you're so certain that it'll be beneficial, then fine. I see no reason to rain on his parade. Thank you. <laughs> yeah. I do what I can. I'm mainly just asking you if you gave our new friend Oramac lies for his birthday. <laughs> so if you're certain, then fine. I... It's it's hard to say what'll what'll end up happening. But I'm hopeful. Alright then. <laughs> I don't know what to get him for his birthday out of character. Oh. <laughs> <laughs> Neither does any of the crew. Yeah, man. <laughs> You're out there about. I like sidle up beside Val, pull a couple of like random like spices for my component pouch. Like maybe he'll like these. Maybe. <laughs> I mean, they're perfectly edible. So they're I've heard. They're sealed and everything. Might be able to make some good stuff with them. All yeah, right. Very, very good on the loot. You could also maybe play him a song. I don't. I don't know. <laughs> You've just, just come out of nowhere. Yeah, I just slid in. Yeah. <laughs> We Ooh, both know that if point, I try to... Drake, if, solid point. Drake, you know that if a loot is drawn within 10 yards of... <laughs> so, <laughs> within 10 yards of Krusk, he'll just go off. Loot! So. Yeah, I was gonna say, I feel like that's already Krusk's <laughs> present. <laughs> like, out of character, I'm just picturing The word Krusk. loot. <laughs> <laughs> like, yeah. like, you're just... It's like, hey, maybe you could play him a song. Do you glance over? Krusk's already in the middle of, like, a whole orchestra. Yeah. <laughs> Son of a bitch! <laughs> like, I mean, I just... oh, Mac! <laughs> He's like All finishing right. up his Hell song. Yeah. <laughs> I have I have an idea. Hold on. And I'll I'll go I'll I'll and I'll like start to move and then turn back. Hold on to the spices though, this might backfire. Gotcha, gotcha. <laughs> Be a good backup plan. So I'm gonna I'm gonna walk over to, to Oramac and uh and uh Krusk and like clap as I approach uh, and be like, that was certainly impressive, Krusk. I'm, I'm sure no one could possibly play any better than that. I'd be very surprised if they could. Well then, Krusk, prepare to be surprised as oh. I have spent weeks constructing the perfect song for Oramac's birthday, which I decidedly knew was coming. Due to Drake's telling me of it. Sure, man. <laughs> I'd love to hear it. Absolutely. As and would I'll I. Produce the loot. Mm hmm. And I'll, I'll say, uh, just try not to get too embarrassed about how good it's going to be. I'm sure you try very hard. 
and I'm <laughs> I'm gonna try to fucking do a, a instrument check to try to play him something off the top of my head. Cool, go I'm gonna ahead. play the first thing that came to my head. It was okay. It was okay. <laughs> yeah, and I'll knowing that that was not at all as good as Krusk's performance, <laughs> turn back to Krusk and say, top that. I wow. don't wish to embarrass you. Oh, surely I'm not the one embarrassed, Krusk. Is that a challenge? Perhaps it is. Go on then, Krusk. Do your best. I need to report that for a New ship. Oh, okay, cool. I do want wow. him to do very, very well, by the way. <laughs> I, I want him to fucking try his hardest to play Oramac the best song ever. <laughs> oh. <laughs> okay. All right, I'm going to use an inspiration for this. Then. Oh, hell yeah. <laughs> All right, here it goes. Oh, dear God. Oh. oh. 28. <laughs> oh, 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 my God. <laughs> Holy shit, Krusk. Hmm. Jesus. He, he can roll 28 some performance, you say, Spence. Charisma-based sure performance. Huh. Mm -hmm. All right, go on with your roleplay. <laughs> Shut the fuck up! We call that expertise, baby. <laughs> oh my god. He plays the best thing you've ever heard. He... I assume, like, oh. with my loot. With assume... your loot, his loot. <laughs> yeah. All of his instruments just start magically playing. <laughs> oh. <laughs> Fucking one second. Oh my second. god. So, what did you think of that? Uh, Val is going to... Not very discreetly <laughs> wipe a tear out of the inside of the mask. <laughs> a single tear. <laughs> All right, then. Goodness. I had no idea. What incredible hubris I had challenging you, Krusk. Not many people see it coming. <laughs> I'm, I guess I'm, I'll take consolation in the fact that I'm surrounded in good company by those who have underestimated you. Oramac hugs you both, one arm around each. Krusk <laughs> uh, uh, didn't even roll a net 20 <laughs> I fucking believe I'm sorry it. fucking excuse me <laughs> no. what did he roll he I mean a bare minimum of 17 yeah oh my god <laughs> yeah Goodness. <laughs> he good at that. He sure is. <laughs> sure is well, a bard. <laughs> I'm glad I got someone else to give Oramek a present. <laughs> <laughs> well played, sir. Oh, well done. All right. Jesus. That shit's now stuck in my head for the next two months. Yep. <laughs> <laughs> All right. As it is getting um, a little late, uh, you you see uh, the weather has gotten noticeably worse as the day has progressed to, to the point where there's a heavy storm going on right now. Mm. It's very dark. Um, looking out to sea... Uh, actually... How many of you have... What is your passive perceptions? Okay, I need uh, you all to roll... 14. 14. I need you all to roll perception. Okay. It's my head. Sure, that sounds like fun. Yeah, Why not? Cool. Why not? 
Okay. Thank you. Brap. Oh, I didn't roll with advantage. I'm stupid. Uh, brap. You there we go. Right. Oh. Yeah. oh. Drake, Val, uh, Drake, Val. Yep, that's it. You too. Okay. Looking out to sea, you spot a small ship on the horizon. It's obscured by the lashing rain, but you can see it keeling dangerously on the wind-stoked uh, waves. Within it is a large bundle about the size of a human. I'll call out that that's a thing and start trying to get something together to draw it in close to our ship. All right. Sam. Yeah. You. So obviously I go to the ballista. Of course. <laughs> <laughs> Let's see. All right. Approaching vessel. Ah! Suddenly. Ah! I gotta change the music. Oh no. Oh no. Uh -oh. Captain told us to avoid fights. God damn it. <laughs> Suddenly, you hear a scream from behind you. You turn around in time to see a six-foot-tall uh, Piscine creature. I think it's Piscine. Uh, P-I-S-C-I-N-E. Uh, Probably? Probably. Yeah. Like fish-like? Yes. Uh, Piscine creature uh, spearing a member of the crew on its crude trident. Its shark-like oh, jaws oh open wide to reveal row upon row of serrated teeth, which are poised to uh, to sink into the crew member's neck. And oh, that's where we're going to end today. <laughs> oh, no! oh! Oh! We're finally going to fight! <laughs> Spencer's uh, just guaranteeing there's at least one fight next session. Because <laughs> Jesus Christ. <laughs> yeah, I'm going to the row. <laughs> Uh. <laughs> and, Woo! Another game I didn't have to prep anything. <laughs> yeah, well, uh, Magic uh, game uh, part two. <laughs> yeah, the at the same time though, because of the holidays and whatnot, we get to resume this a next. Friday. It's true. Yeah. We get to do this Three next week. from now. Yeah. But yeah, these first three episodes have been much more character than plot focused. So yeah, it'll be Don't, good to get back yeah. into what the fuck is happening. Y'all got some that, plot. Y'all got some plot today. You got is hints it? of plot. It's very true. From the captain there. Uh, yeah. <laughs> but yeah, it's, you it's fucking proxies. <laughs> yeah. Carrie, I am also here for the character stuff, but I'm also here for the variety. <laughs> I get mm -hmm. you. It uh, can't be all just the one thing. I, I feel you. Krask, okay. play that same one note for the hundredth time, baby! Yo, <laughs> right, baby! <laughs> all right. Ooh, so. We got a little more, uh, oh, heck. More we, got, donations. we got two more donations. Oh, hey, uh, Both it. from Tucker oh, White. Uh, One dollar says, well, this was fun. Now all I need is for this to go to the DM and to be noticed by the three ah. Canadians on this stream, and I'll be on my way. Uh, There's Inuyasha to binge. Do I count as a Canadian now? Oh, my God. Uh, No, they were clearly ah. talking about me. So mm -hmm, mm -hmm. Okay, it's fine. I'll shut up. Yeah, it's <laughs> stupid. <sighs> yeah, his nickname okay. is Bud. We've been calling him Bud A. <laughs> Mm-hmm, mm-hmm. Fucking D and D two weeks in a row. Tis the season. Oh, <laughs> yeah! I love it. I, That's fucking excellent. I love how our name, like, That's there is always so another pun that can be made. Mm -hmm. It's so good. Infinite pun. Uh, uh -huh. My goodness. <laughs> and also, uh, one more donation from Tucker oh. White. Another dollar. Oh. And he just fucking <gasps> button smashed on his keyboard. <laughs> Uh, just fucking. <laughs> I'll just add two more inspiration Woo! there. Yeah, and uh, so it's it's gonna be Sweeney two weeks in a row, mm -hmm. but we're going to. It's mm -hmm. also going to be three streams in a row. Because yes. we're we're taking off that that we're we're taking off. Yeah, we're taking off the the two weeks for. Taking Crimbob and New Year, and then yeah. we'll be back on the eighth with yet more swinging. Oh, yeah. Weeks in between the second and third, but it's 
two weeks in a row and then in total three streams in a row of Sweet Indy. Mm -hmm. yeah. So yeah. we got to get time. to island. <laughs> mm -hmm. oh. land. land! Land! Land, whore! Land! <laughs> You scream at the captain and she doesn't like you anymore. <laughs> Crust like... <laughs> yeah. played his song like, this is the greatest and best song in the world. <laughs> Tribute. Tribute. <laughs> yeah. He played the no. first thing that came to his Hell head. Hell yes. What, what Just so happened to be. What what Crust played is the song that they are always doing a tribute to. Yeah. yeah. <laughs> oh. Fucking last fun fact about Tenacious D. Uh, they played Tribute in, I believe, Australia, and the crowd moving around to Tribute registered on the Richter scale. Oh my god! Holy shit! Oh my god! Oh, yeah, That's, That's incredible. a captive audience. It's yeah, the best is. song in the world. Uh, the best oh song god. in the world. King Hubris uh, did very cute fucking Captain um, Ormac art, and I'm not okay. Yeah, I saw it. Oh my um, god! Let's see this one. Let me see. Oh, <laughs> it's so cute. Oh, my heart. I can't. You're so cute. You got it. Huh? Oh. Absolutely annihilated. Oh. The cat anyway. is so fucking cute in that picture. Guys. Yeah, she is. Art. Oh, my God. You're all right. Yeah. Oh, I yeah. can't. Dear God. Nothing at all like the face claims. <laughs> <laughs> right? <Yeah. laughs> it's such a stark difference there. It's, it's fine. Who gives also, a shit? Very <laughs> good memes by Hubris and Zucorin. No, my bad. Oh my god. Oh, that's I, ridiculous. I also really like Cribozy's so bit of Kasim blow, you know, blowing the sleep spell. Oh, mm -hmm. yeah. Yeah. <laughs> yeah. It's, it's basically so Val's POV. <laughs> mm -hmm. You guys are ridiculous. Oh, uh, uh, Agent of Chaos! Uh, <laughs> Anyways, oh, let's go ahead and end the YouTube recording. Yeah. yeah. Okay. Yeah. Thanks everyone for joining us for episode three. Yeah. yeah. Thank you so much. Goodbye, my boys. Goodbye, Goodbye YouTube. Goodbye, my boys. We love you, everyone.